Well, we are back, huh? We're back at the Nine Club, everybody. Today, we have a very special, special, special guest. Brianna Gearing is with us. Yes. How are you? I'm doing great, Chris. How you doing? I'm doing pretty good now that you're here. Thank you so much for coming. Thanks for having me. Oh, my gosh. This is great. Cheers. Girl, Cheers. Girl, I know chocolate. Are you? Kelly. Yep. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> uh, weirdly enough, with me, we've met a long or quite some time ago, but this is your first time meeting Jerron. Yeah. Yeah. I met everybody here except Jerron. And you guys Dang. are both pro on the same team? This is true. I mean, I'm, I'm, at, the, I'm at the tail end of mine, but hey. <laughs> She's at the beginning of hers. This yeah, that's tight. Are we swapping out? It, I mean, I don't want to swap out. No, we'll just. We'll, no, you guys we'll keep going. We'll be here together. There yeah, we go. Yeah, there there we go. go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, it's understandable nowadays because, I mean, when did you get on, girl? Let's talk. Let's just start there really quickly. I think like three years ago. Okay, three years ago. Sounds right. Recently, pro. Congratulations. Yeah. yeah. That's Thanks, amazing. Chris. Congrats. That's amazing. I love that she called me Chris. <laughs> <laughs> It's what the way, am I supposed it's, to call you, Crops? <laughs> it's yeah, the way no. that she's saying it, is, it though. It's so good. It's so good. <laughs> oh, really? You know? Yeah. I love it. I love it. But uh, that's amazing. But let's talk about also the Thrasher cover that just oh, came man. out. Oh, <laughs> Listen. Man. Wow. I mean, was that a that's surprise to you? Did you know? know? Did you know about that? Dude, I had no idea. I was on a, a Vans trip in Toronto. And one of my really good friends I grew up with called me and he was like, hey, I heard you got the cover of Thrasher. I was like, what? no, I didn't. <laughs> like, that's not even like, why would you even call me to say that? That's fucking stupid. Yeah. And then he was like, no, I'm pretty sure you did. Someone told me, like, go look on Instagram. And I was walking down to the beach with Stefan to go meet up with my friend, like Landon and Ryan. And I looked on it. And I was like, oh, fuck. He wasn't kidding. It's on there. I was like, Yo, what the fuck? I was like. I didn't really that's know what to do. Crazy. That's crazy. Congrats on that. Yeah, Thanks, that's dude. big. Wow. Straight up. That was a fucked up spot. Yeah, how, how did you way? find that one? It, like it was like a room. <laughs> but it was cool also then to see the footage later, you know, because mm -hmm. uh, Crooks to Fakey, I believe. Yep. And then what was it on a roof or some, some weird? It was the weirdest ground. It was like, it's all fucked up. Yeah, it was on a roof in San Bernardino. Oh, oh it was San out Bernardino. here. Yeah, and someone took us to that spot and like... The, the metal on top where you like grind it wasn't attached at all. So sometimes <laughs> I would start grinding it and it would just, like shoot right off the end of it. Oh, what? Shit. Wait a minute. It was up there, but just loose. It wasn't attached. Yeah, it just was like not attached. Wow. And so you were just powering through it. And then what? I don't know. Didn't you, didn't you hammer you can... it in there or something? No. What's going on? No. It was like, because it was all like soft ground. Oh. So it would kind of like stay. But then if you would like push in too hard it would like slide i got mm. you yeah. i got you did was it your idea to go look at that thing or someone's like brianna we have the best spot for you no it and wasn't they, even it, like it was like a fat fucking crew of people and mm. marby brought us to that spot actually did anyone else skate with you everyone was skating it everyone was skating it. oh yeah oh. that doesn't look like a sessionable spot i would have been sitting down in the <laughs> van it really does i would have been getting you all coffees and stuff that's amazing the burp. <laughs> what everybody... bless you Thank you. What was everybody? Uh, I mean, obviously, who shot the photo, by the way? Taylor Ballard. Taylor Ballard. Is it Mike Ballard's son? <laughs> I don't. I don't know. Huh. Do you want me to ask him? Hey, please, yeah. <laughs> 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 uh, Mike Ballard, o OG photographer in yeah. the game. But um, so that's amazing. So congrats. Thanks, God, dude. I've never Appreciate gotten a that. cover. Yeah. You know? No, Thrasher cover. That's big. That's shit, man. huge. As we know. John, you got a cover. You got a strength cover, right? That's my only cover. Okay. Really? Yeah. That's sick. We Talking some... about cover shit. What was your What was your cover? Uh, it was an ollie over a fucking uh, that thing that Gino sk skated in West Hollywood. You know, he did a Swiss French pop shove it over. Oh, the little gate thing. The gate thing. Yeah, off the bump. But the, you know, before the gate. Yeah, yeah, the, yeah, yeah. Now there was yeah. there was a gate at that time. Oh, switch ollie. Not switch ollie. Ollie. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> my, my, my bad. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's amazing though. When that's funny to find out through Instagram, right? You don't even have it in your hands. You just see it on. The, it's a trip. Yeah. Yeah, but it was fun. Yeah. Because I, I like met up with them and I was like, "Yo, guys, you won't believe this." <laughs> <laughs> wow. Your sponsors are probably hyped. Fuck, Fuck yeah. Yeah, Zach and Kevin at Vans called me and they were like, "We got your Ubers tonight. Where you want to go?" I was like, oh, "Yeah, let's go." Shit. Where did you go? We just went to this like crusty ass pool bar in Toronto. And <laughs> Had some beers and everyone was like, okay, let's go to bed. 
That's so tight, though. So wait, were you you were out here on a Vans trip doing that? Is no, that what it's it was? in Toronto. No, no, no. But when you got the cover, when oh, you got yeah. when you when you uh, filmed, when you, uh, shot the photo. Yeah, it was like kind of a trip, but I borderline was like living here for four months. Oh, you just, were just kept staying. Okay, an extra month, you know, and then four, the four months you're like, I live there. Yeah, yeah, yeah for yeah. sure. Yeah. Past three months, that's it. Yeah. Yeah. That's, but wait a minute, can you, days are good. can you not stay past three months? I, don't, I thought, I don't know the stipulations for uh, Canadians. Canadians, yeah. It's like six months out of the year. Ah. But yeah, maybe don't, don't tell, don't let the police show. Oh, see okay. This, but I kind of lived here. <laughs> okay, okay. Well, nobody, yeah, cops don't watch this show. <laughs> it don't well, maybe they do, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> so that's cool. So little trip down here, got the cover, nice nice trip yeah wow. and you were filming for the vans video at that point is that what it was yeah uh, amazing so let's talk about you know canada um i grew up in Kelowna, which is like four hours outside of vancouver okay okay and yeah how was that growing up there it was cool it was kind of boring is it a big city is it a uh, mediocre what's going on out there it's, <laughs> <laughs> it's a pretty small city um because i was in west Kelowna actually and I mean, there's nothing really to do. People mm. kind of just get into trouble there, you Got know. Got you. Okay, one yeah. of those cities. Yeah. Is there a lot of skaters there? No, there wasn't. But then, like, the group of kids I grew up with, there was lots of skaters. Okay. Mm. So how did you that, find skating out, being out there? Is that how you got into it? Um, One of my big sisters had, like, a board that her dad gave her. And then it was, like, really old. It was from Zellers. It's, like, the Canadian shitty Target. Okay. Oh, okay. But it was, it was epic when it was around. Yeah. But... <laughs> Um, it was just like laying in the garage all old, like just weathering. And I found it one day and I started riding it around and I was like, oh, kind of like juiced on this. Like, That's and then, yeah, I just got really into it. I asked my parents if I could get a Walmart board and they were like, going to have to save up for it. So like, yeah, was saved there, up 20 bucks, got a Walmart board. And then it was like 20 bucks. Dude, when you're fucking like 12, 20 bucks is a lot of money. I know, yeah. but still, that's cheap for a board. Oh, yeah. Yeah. But, you're able to, yeah, but that is some cheap yeah. material yeah. that they're using well, on the board. I mean, this is true. I yeah. mean, the trucks true. literally snapped, and I weighed like 70 pounds. So. The Walmart board was done. Snapped the trucks. That's really Plastic wild. trucks? They were, were metal. They, they were just really? so yeah, bad. Just, good you God. pay for what you get. You I mean, yeah, that's true. Yeah, exactly. 20 bucks. 20 uh, bucks. That's not even a pair of trucks. So yeah, wait, even, were you, were you skating with people in your neighborhood or were you just solo? At first I was just skating by myself. Driveway but like, and stuff. Yeah, driveway yeah, missions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, missions. Everybody knows about the driveway oh, missions. Oh yeah, That's for sure. Did you have anything in the driveway? Like uh, little bumps or did you make any little like, you know, little launch ramps or anything? It was like a slight incline. Yeah. So you could kind of yeah. like go up and the ground was really rough. So it was like stall. And then like try to flip your board and then like roll back down, but it's almost like borderline just flat ground, you know. But you're like I fucking kick flip the bank. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. kick flip the fakey on this bank. Yeah. yeah. How old were you? I was twelve when I started skating. Twelve. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. How Perfect. old were you? I was fifteen. Oh, you were like kind of older. A little yeah. old. I got started a little late. Yeah. yeah. But I always had a board around me, you know. I always like butt boarded or knee boarded or stuff like that. But I uh, didn't really get my board until I was like fifteen. Mm -hmm. uh, friends, you know. They, Got me into it. Yeah. But um, so how did, um, th then did you start meeting uh, other skaters through school and stuff like that? Um, there was like one of my, my best friends like lived down the street and he skated and he could varial flip. Ooh. Mm -hmm. And Love he always trick. had a flat bar. Okay. So we would meet like, like I lived on this street, he lived on this street and we would meet at this street light right in the middle. And he like, he would bring his flat bar and we would skate out there at night. Under the street light. Yeah. yeah. So we just skate there like all the time. Okay. Because he wasn't allowed to go anywhere. Why? His parents were just like strict. Wow. So we would just like skate on his street under the light. Oh, he couldn't go past the street. <laughs> he couldn't go <laughs> past they the street Make a walk light. out and be like, okay, yeah. he's there. Were you learning tricks on this Walmart board? <laughs> yeah. I learned how to like do a bunch of tricks on the Walmart board. Like what? Kick, did you learn a kick flip on the Walmart board? Yeah. Oh, Damn. shit. Burial flip? For some reason, I learned fakey big flips before like... Wait, 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 wait. Like wait, varial wait, wait. flips? Oh, okay, before varial Cause flips. Because I, I would just like fling them, you know, and then at some point it just starts working. You yep. just start landing on that shit. Yeah. <laughs> there's some yes. there's some tricks that just seemed, it seemed easier when you start skating. It's almost like a varial flip seems easier just because you're flinging it and it yeah. just spins 180. seems like a kickflip, it's harder to keep straight when yep. you start. You yeah, know? they just Definitely. always want a varial or you're just like, yeah. I kind of remember at a point being really good at like disco flips. 
What the hell is a disco flip? You know, like kickflip body burial. Oh, ah, okay. Because, yes. you know, like you're like trying to flick it, but your like, body's doing all this yeah, crazy yeah, shit because yeah. you can't control it. Yep. My, I would naturally do that too, but I could never land it. I'd always do like one foot and I never oh, understood yeah. what was going on. It's always a one foot. Yeah. It's a worst. I got it. Yeah, you're trying to get that. If it flips perfectly, you're one foot. Mm -hmm. Shoulders. You know, Dude, it's you, a shoulders. chicken thing. Uh, uh, what? It's a bit of a chicken thing, though. You don't know how to like make yourself just like go on top of it. Yeah. I know, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But when you, yeah. that one time it happens, you then like, you're like, it clicks. It That's clicks. what I do. Yeah. <laughs> it clicks for sure. How did you remember your first kickflip? No, I remember having them at a point and then not having them all of a sudden. Yeah, I remember like relearning it more than I remember the f initial learn. Mm. Yeah. Maybe it was because you got that new board after you got that Walmart board, you got an actual real board. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, 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 I was like going fast and shit. I was like, I don't know what to do anymore. <laughs> what was your what was the real board that you got? Their first board. The first real board I had was like this kid down the street gave me this white old mystery board that was like squared out. Mm. And then they gave me like speed demon trucks. Oh, oh speed okay. demon trucks. You know those? Speed yeah. demons were like bearings yeah, back in the day. It was like some West forty nine brand. Do you know what that is? No. It's like the mm -hmm. Canadian yeah, Zoomies, yeah. kind of. Yeah. Oh, yeah. okay, yeah. You know. Yes, heard of it. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely. And, I don't know, some, like, random bearings and some, like, old black wheels. But okay. that was my first setup. And then one day I, my dad, I don't remember how this happened, but he took me to the skate shop and we were getting a board. And I almost got a Death Wish board because I thought the graphic was really cool. And then this kid that was my age, but he was, like, a good skater, I was like, what? I'm like, what board should I get? And he was like, get this plan B board, like P. Duffy, like P2, it's sick. P. Duffy. P Pad Duffy. Oh, P. Duffy. <laughs> so that was my first real board. Oh, first Pad, Pad Duffy board. Yeah. Oh. P2. I was like, oh, we'll never break. I'm good. Oh, the P2 would. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The, shit that the guarantee, like, this shit won't break. It didn't break. I was like, I need a new board. Fuck, it's all <laughs> fucked on the ends. <laughs> I can't break it. <laughs> the mystery board was like dipped. Bro. It was a dipped white board. It was like dipped white yeah. board, yeah. That was You know thing, the one. Yeah. But yeah. I know. Yeah. Oh, listen, <laughs> I know the ones. So, but it, but it got you by, though. Got you oh, it onto did the, the real. Thing. Yeah, mm -hmm. for sure. Were you, were you skating the flat bar as well? Yeah, we were just skating the flat bar, skating the suburbs. Yeah. There wasn't like too much to skate around. Just. Probably why I skate a lot of flat ground. Yeah. Flat ground's fun. That's where it starts, it's, where it's, more, it's the most relatable thing. You go outside, you can skate it. You don't Straight need up. anything. Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. So when you're growing up out there and you say you go skate, like, did you go into the actual city to go skate? I mean, what age were you when you, like, started venturing off with, like, homies and stuff? Sometimes when I was, like, 13 and 14, we'd go into West Bank. But mm -hmm. it was, like, it's not, like, a real city. It was, like, super spread out okay like suburby city you know yeah, right. and we just had this skate park that was built by a bmxer like 20 years ago so it was like <laughs> crusty asphalt mm. the like the ramps to the quarter pipes weren't lined with the ground so there was like cracks and shit and like it's just nothing made sense you right. can't go fast enough to skate do you think the three blocks run up was like about the size of this table oh geez. so that's where like i would skate all the time but it was like really Annoying. So we would more go just find stuff to skate in the city rather than skate there because it was like. Gotcha. It's like, it what's the point? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right, 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 right. None of it. We didn't have good enough fucking bearings to skate the park. It's like so crushed. Too slow. I mean, those shit. BMX, I mean, they could be like really steep and, you know, just. Um, and the ground's so weathered out there. Yeah. 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 So you're starting to skate. What what videos are you seeing? Are you watching YouTube videos <laughs> or like what's your first introduction skate video wise? I think that we like, I think I started watching skate like videos on YouTube first. Yeah. And then someone was like, you haven't watched a full length video. Like you haven't seen. That's been a topic of conversation really like with a bunch of like newer skaters and oh, yeah. in the yeah. YouTube world. Like they don't really see videos. They see videos, but they see them on YouTube. And sometimes like when they first start skating, they don't see them for, for a dumb long. Or they're yeah. just you know seeing I mean? the separated parts. Yeah. They're or just seeing, their, they're yeah, not yeah. seeing the full length video totally. and getting a vibe. Yeah. You yeah. know. For sure. It's like yeah, it's we're weird. losing that to a certain degree, but... You know. was ah, but you know what, though? They start skating, but then they, they go back and revisit it. Like, I'm totally. sure you went back and watched all the videos and stuff, too, right? Yeah. Right. Yeah, like, my friends gave me shit for not watching Stay Gold. Oh, seriously? Oh, yeah? Wow. Yeah, and I was like, oh, fuck, I gotta start watching like, <laughs> videos. I was like, I didn't know it was such a thing, man. Yeah, <laughs> They're like, yeah, you I gotta mean, know your shit. Like, it's seriously. a good video. Man. I'm Stay glad gold? they told me. I was like, fuck, I've been blowing it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. What that was the thing. first like YouTube video that you remember watching? I think I used to just look up girls skating all the mm. time. Because oh, I was okay. like, I want to see like a girl skating. Right. And so. then I totally watched Vanessa Torres, Alyssa, Marissa and stuff. 
I don't remember the first video I watched, but those are the ones that I remember the most, you know? That's right, right, right. right. How were your parents uh, during the whole coming up in skating? Were they supportive? Yeah, they were so chill. They were just like... You're good if you finish like high school. Okay, that's what they. That's what they were. (laughs) Whatever you want, just fucking finish high school. (laughs) That's all they wanted—the high school diploma. Yeah. Yeah. Did you get it? Oh, I got it. Oh, I got it. All right. Perfect. Perfect. A lot of skaters. Yes. I got that shit. Oh, I got it. Okay, we're all good in this. I mean, listen, a lot of skaters don't get it though. A lot of stuff in in uh, coming out of high school just it just starts. The skateboarding just starts for them, you know, and they go on these trips and yeah, that's oh, I'll, I'll finish I remember, later. I remember see, like even taking a tally on Girl and Chocolate. Like, this is a while ago. I was like, bro, like, what's the percentage of people that have graduated on Girl and Chocolate? And man, I asked everybody, and I, I guarantee, I, it was probably like maybe three people, if mm-hmm. that, two people. I was like, holy shit! Whoa. But this was at the time. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, where we're at. I don't, this, is back this is back then. then. Oh, I don't know where wow. we're at now. But mm-hmm. you know, <laughs> what does school really teach you anyway? I Nothing mean, it doesn't. It, do, it doesn't matter. At the end of the day, <laughs> well, actually, it does matter. But <laughs> <laughs> but the, everybody's turned out to be you know successful in their own right, and you yeah. know everything turned sure. out okay for sure. I mean, yeah. you did graduate high school, but like, what if your son had that same thing where you started skating that, he, or what? He ain't doing that. Oh, he's going to graduate. Okay, okay. I just, <laughs> Don't even go there. I'm just yeah. not, listen, I just, like, what I do, I You see questions. his face right there? He was yeah. like, nah. <laughs> nah, nah. <laughs> what if he had a, like a big career that was... I mean, that would be, yeah. I bet it, there's going to be school involved to some degree. Okay. I'm, I'm just asking. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Just, I don't know. Yeah. A lot of people are yeah. doing. There's a big discussion right now. Can I use this? Yeah, of course. It's perfect thing to use. Crack yeah. it open. There we go. Going. Love it. Uh, so that's amazing, though. The parents were very supportive and stuff. It made oh, it a lot they easier. They were down as fuck. That's cool. That's <laughs> so cool. Sick. Made it a lot easier to follow your uh, your passion. Yeah. You know what I mean, yeah. which I think is important for kids. That's you know? something I appreciate so much, but then I forget how good I had it. You know, like with that in right. that aspect. For right. sure. For sure. So when did you, you know, skating with all your friends and everything, did you, when did you start realizing that possibly like a sponsor or any of this stuff was like obtainable? You know, because sometimes when I grew up, I didn't think it was obtainable. I thought it was the furthest thing from my my reach. Yeah. You know, I don't know if you ever think it's like attainable. You just like want it. You're like, ah, that would be fucking awesome. But you don't expect it. You're not like, oh, this is going to happen. Like, I got this shit. Sure. I don't think I ever thought that way anyway. What about like making sponsor me videos? Were you? Oh, we did that for fucking sure. But like, (laughs) dude, my first sponsor me video, my ender was kicked up a four and it was originally to bangerang by skrillex oh. and my big sister was like no no put it to cream it by wu-tang clan oh. so i put it to that <laughs> cash rules everything around me yeah okay and i went into the skate shop which shop it was called free ride board shop okay i went in there i showed it to them i uploaded it on youtube Wu-Tang fucking cream it playing in the whole store. It was on the whole speaker <laughs> oh, system. Oh. And they watched it and I was just like mortified. I was like, <laughs> I was like, I realized what I had done. You know, I was like, I think I came in here too soon. <laughs> you you went in there so hyped and while it was going on, you realized your mistake. I was like, oh, this is weird. Like, this is weird. Well, what did I mean, they say? Just, I, mean, yeah. I was about to say what they Were they say. just standing around just like? Yeah, I was just like sweating. And he was like, oh, this is this is good. Nice. Like, awesome. Like, I don't remember anything else he said. I don't think he was you, like, can't come back, get a board. You blacked out, <laughs> yeah, pretty blackout much. Yeah, blackout moment. So did, yeah. did you not get, they didn't put no. you on the team? No. Oh, it's no. like, nice try. Yeah, yeah. they're like, that's cool. <laughs> yeah. They're like, come Great back song. in a couple months. <laughs> yeah, keep filming, do your thing. So that wasn't the last sponsor me video you filmed, obviously. You uh, made another one. I don't think so. Really? No. We're just making homie videos then? Or what were you doing? No. No, <laughs> I mean it? not really. Like we all had fucking like those like digital cameras that oh, were yeah. just like this that we yeah. were filming on, and we would just make like YouTube videos. But it weren't wasn't like for anything. Mm. Wait a minute, is your sponsor me video still on YouTube? I wish. What I happened? wish. It... I think when I turned like fifteen, I was like, this all needs to go, and oh, I deleted you... everything. <laughs> 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 and now I regret it because I'm like, that shit was so funny. I wish uh, I still had it. You, you don't it think you, you don't have access to like getting it again? No, it's gone, gone. Oh wow. Yeah. Oh, that's what the private button's for. Nobody could see it. You're not in your right mind. You're just I didn't like, know. I know. At the time. I mean, listen. She was mortified when she was standing <laughs> in the <laughs> shop. She's like, this has to go. Yeah. This has to go. How old were you when you tried to get sponsored by them? I think I was 14. 14? Yeah. Okay. So this is two years after you started skating. Yeah. <laughs> I guess. That's amazing. 
Kick with the so Forest awesome. Air. To Skrillex? That was the first song you had in there? Bangarang. Bangarang. Real ones, no. Okay. I'm not, I don't, I'm not real one. <laughs> you have no <laughs> idea. Uh, no clue. No idea. Heard of Skrillex. Uh, I've yeah, heard yeah, of Skrillex. Yeah. 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 No, it's not good, but when you're 14, that shit smacks. Uh, like, shit. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So what was your first sponsor? Did you get it? Did you get it sponsored by a shop or something? What was going um, on out there in uh, Kelowna? Up in Canada? Yeah. Up in Canada. <laughs> Uh, it was like this uh, go skate day and they had a game of skate and I think I won it but not for like all the kids I was like 15 and under okay, or some shit okay. and they were you like still oh, got a W yeah I got a win out there mm-hmm. and they were like they were like do you want to ride for like West? it was West 49 they were like do you want to ride for West 49 I was like fuck yeah of course and I got this like seven and a half plan B board with like P rod and like four of the dudes faces on it. Oh, and I, it was like I was like this was is like too a, small a, to skate. A cartoon board, cartoon. Yeah, you be, fucking yeah. know the one, don't yeah, you? Yeah, you just know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you didn't, no, you didn't ride? Days. What size boards did you ride back then? Since think, seven and a half was too small. It was way too small. I, I mean, think I was riding an eight. Oh, okay. It wasn't probably sm- too small for me, but I was like, I can't. Like, I mean, even seven and a half is too. It's pretty I damn guess. small. Pretty I guess back then I used to ride seven and a half, so I think it was. But that you're so much younger. What what year was this? Like, like a smaller board would be like good. 2005 or something. No. 2000. No. I'm it was like 2012. Oh my gosh! I'm delusional right now. Mm. I can't. Yeah. Yeah. Drink some more coffee. I'm like way timing is way off. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so. <laughs> What were you doing in 2003? How <laughs> <laughs> like, hell do you think she is here? I was in kindergarten. I'm just thinking in my head, and then I'm just like not even realizing. Yeah. Wow. You. you st- well, how old? Wait. How old are you? I'm 22. 99? 98. 98. I'm almost 23. Oh. Uh, almost. Oh, yeah. Getting old. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right? God. What month's a birthday? What month? What, what sign are you? I'm a Capricorn. Capricorn. Are you, are you guys? I'm a Leo. Aquarius. Libra. God, we're all different. Okay, right? okay. <laughs> what are you, Raj? You make sense as an Gemini. Aquarius. Gemini. Yeah? Yeah, you're like... Nobody knows what the fuck's going on with you. <laughs> <laughs> the uh, you can't, you can't He's call it. Huh? Stone face. Stone face. Yeah. Yeah. Right, take, he I'll is take funny it. as fuck, though. You're, my mom's a Leo. Oh, so. yeah? I don't know, though. I've been told that I'm not really the Leo type, though. Uh. I don't think I can speak on it realistically, but... Okay. Are you good with the... You know the obviously, you knew his sign, you no. know? Do you I just up? know Aquariuses are like a specific breed of people. How, yeah. how specific? No one can understand an Aquarius, but they're always really sick. But like, you can't expect for them to. F- you can't expect them to fuck with you. Oh, okay. You cannot mm-hmm. expect that. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. I like that. Yeah, I don't know about the signs. <laughs> I never really kept up with the signs. I've just been told that little. Yeah, you're. I don't know if you're really a Leo. Yeah. But and I've been told differently. What about? <laughs> I wish I had more answers for you. I know. Yeah. I know. <laughs> One of these days, I'll try to figure it out. Because there's a whole thing where you could get your birthday day the time you were born and you could do all these calculations yeah fucking nuts you guys never fucked with costar what's that no nah, you guys wouldn't come on what what's costar? Wait, is, what that is, that? is that an app is it the app yeah what so is costar a, i think i might have done it once a couple years ago you like just give us a, a breakdown what is you? it okay what is you it? put your whole shit in there okay even the time you were born That's and then it tells you like you're rising you're Falling your moon. I don't know. Oh, There's no God. falling. But like, I don't all know. That kind I, don't, of shit. I don't understand the moon talk and all the, the signs I, and all that. Well, like it's the stars the, where the moon was at the time and the, you know, it's a whole. That's what I'm saying. I have not even just tried to get involved with that. It's fun though, because then you're kind of like, you read it every day and you're like, you see if it's it like, a little you inspiring. See if it, you see if it relates to your life at all. It's it kind of does though. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Because it's, it's cool. just vague enough. Yeah. Right. It's vague. Right. right. Yeah. And, and that's the thing with the horoscopes. I'll look at it and be like, oh, shit, that really? Yeah. Mm-hmm. There's another app called The Pattern. It's pretty good, too. The Pattern? Yeah. She's uh. like, where does that come from? Raj, where are you uh, at? He's, he's down the <laughs> street I'm, I'm getting, in the a, closet. getting a coffee. <laughs> um, it's interesting because I've never, yeah, that's, uh, huh, uh, the whole time thing. So they give you daily updates. My question is, who's writing this shit? I don't know. Yeah, you know it's a I mean? great question. Who's writing these things? Yeah. Who's sitting around writing every daily thing for each individual Like for sign. like work life, love life, oh all, my all God. the different types of things. All the Family. Lives. Yeah, all the, all lives. the lives. Astrologists. These guys. But come on, Dubs. Yeah, really <laughs> really they know what they're talking you about. Think so? <laughs> I don't know, bro. Like she said, it's, it's like vague. It's re- it really is. Oh, you're going to have a great day today, Dubs. But there's certain people like what I, if I'm Aquarius, right? There's certain people that I vibe with more mm. so. Like I, I vibe with Gemini's, and Gemini's are fucking, you know, obviously Jekyll and Hyde oh. to a degree. 
Okay. Um, and who's if your birthday falls in uh, like late August? What was that? What would that be? Uh, I'm kind of mid August, so I'm a Leo, but I don't know what follows a Leo. I'm not so sure. So then maybe I vibe with fucking Leos. Oh, huh. so we, we vibe. Is we it, do. Yeah, is we it vibe. Virgo? Hmm? Do you like Virgos? That might be it too. I think Leos Virgos after Leo. That Virgos might be the that who's the one be because like Tim, Rick Howard, Carol. You know what I mean? Like mm. these, they're what all Leos. They? What are they? Exactly, these guys. I fucking they're all I vibe with them, and they're all yeah. What's dude, the Virgos? They're, they're, they're all late August. Virgos always are fucking sick. Yeah. yeah, Virgos are always sick. Isn't there one that you usually don't fuck with? There usually is. Yeah. I guess. there's a couple. Who, what, what are you? Libra. That's the one I don't fuck with. I knew that was good. <laughs> I walk right. The setup that is so real. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. The dub sock coming a mile away. Huh? <laughs> Fuck. So <laughs> let's. Uh, this is what we do. Yeah. yeah. Let it's, me say. We're, we're we're idiots. But listen. <laughs> uh So you got on West Forty Ninth. What was this shop called? It's West Forty Nine. West Forty Nine. You must have been over the moon, except for the seven seven five board. I mean seven point five board. You did you return it? Did you trade it in for something? What'd you do? Mm-hmm. They asked me if I wanted to trade it in, and I was like, I'm not fucking like letting go of this thing. I do not want to trade it in. I'm just gonna keep it. Oh, it was nice. kind of like a prize. It was like a trophy. Yeah, it was almost. Like, like first free board. You're like, yeah. So what'd you do? Then you went in and bought a board from them. I don't understand. Full yeah, discount? I think that is what I did. Yeah. What was, so wait, you do buy? you still have that board? No. Okay. Oh. I went through that phase of like harsh, you know, get rid of all that stuff. Why? Mm-hmm. YouTube videos, like, old boards. You know, I was like, no, no, no. <laughs> Just cleaning out the closet. You're getting, more, getting rid of that shit. Yeah. <laughs> so what board did you get? The cheapest board to get for 20 bucks. I could get a Red Star or an ATM board because of my discount too are we talking about atm click yeah yeah, yeah. oh Damn. shit what's red star come on kelly you should know red star Paul back now yeah dude mm. i've never heard of it I- it was it was totally a canadian thing but oh mm. yeah, this, paul mac now was on dark star though but he was on red star he was on he was double dipping I don't know two if it was the same When he left Dark Star to go on Red Star? There it goes. I don't, I don't, I know. don't know that. Damn, he left, he left one star, star for the other star. Shit. <laughs> I don't know. It. <laughs> Crazy. It's a crazy world we live in, Dubs. It really is. Dark Star so, or Red Star? Yeah. yeah, Dark Red Star, Blue <laughs> yeah. Star, Green Star. Who else star. was on Red Star? All I don't stars. actually even know. I would just... I'm intrigued by this. I didn't know this much about Canadian skateboarding. I knew I know a lot, but I didn't know about Red Star. Now, was this all of? Was this a big Canadian company, or was it just um, you know individual like states or Red Star? Yeah. Or, no, it was like all of Canada. It was all okay. Because as we learn here, like like um, homie was talking about the Arizona companies, Deshaun, oh, Deshaun yeah. Jordan. It's oh like, yeah. Arizona's right next door to us, and we haven't heard of any of the companies that came out of there. Yeah, he was he yeah. wrote for homicide skateboards, yeah. zombie skateboards, zombie. Yeah. Oh shit! Yeah, the yeah. A- <laughs> yeah, the AZ Post or what? AZ Breeze or something? The first cover you got? I mean, yeah, I don't know. Did yeah. you ever meet Grant Patterson skating out there? I know the name. I don't know Grant Look him Patterson. Up. OG. He's OG in the game. Yeah. yeah. Really baggy clothes. Road for blind. He did. Road for blind. Yeah. He's tight. Where like is that. Rod? <laughs> I told you he's at Starbucks down the street. Get your no, really? He's, got his no, he's, he's right behind you. Yeah, he's taking <laughs> a walk down the block. He's on the side of that wall. Um, so that, yeah, that leads me to the question, like, who were you looking up to? Who were your favorite skaters uh, when you were growing up? Marissa and Alyssa. Marissa and Vanessa. And, and Marissa, Alyssa, and Vanessa. Oh, yeah. Okay. The, I mean, great skaters That's to look great up to. Great for sure. Oh. Fuck yeah. Had some steamy. fine people to look up to for sure. Jamie yeah. Reyes. We were just talking about Jamie Reyes oh, before yeah. the show. Oh my god. I didn't god. know about Jamie Reyes till I got older. Really? Her videos weren't on YouTube when I was looking up girls okay. who skate, so <laughs> I didn't see you it. Couldn't find her. No. God, that's crazy. so sick. Yeah, she's been around for years. Yeah. She's so dope. Okay, so then you got uh, West Forty Nine. That was going. Now, where were they? Were they giving you discounts, or were they just like? It was just kind of like a status thing. Like you're on this west 49 shop because it seems to me like they just gave you one board oh uh, they were just giving they were giving me discounts on okay stuff. yeah okay. it was like that okay. and that was that shop far away from where you lived yeah it was like a 30 minute drive i guess okay so the taking the bus there was like that's a mission huh it was a bit of a mission yeah, but yeah. it's about like an hour 45 with all the stops you know your stops and stuff yeah. i used to take the bus all the time dude okay. <laughs> Did you get sponsored? I mean, what was it after that? After the West 49? 
Because yeah, you said well, you weren't making any more skate videos. I mean, any more sponsor me tapes. So no. how did you how did you start getting hooked up? Um. Um. <laughs> <laughs> She's getting scared. No, because <laughs> here's the reason I ask, right? Well, it's a, it's also interesting, but we find also that sometimes the you know if you live in a different country, Canadian skaters as well, like they have a harder time getting through the industry. Mm-hmm. It's like distributor flow. It's distributor. You're on this company, but you're only on distributor. You know this and that. So. And some people have a clear path right into the industry. So it's interesting how people kind of navigate that, you know, mm-hmm. uh, especially in Canada, our neighbors, you know, they're right, yeah. we're right there. But it's irrelevant. Yeah. If you're not in Canada, it's pretty irrelevant to everyone else. I, I, in I a see way. what you're saying. Well, yeah, for they sure, have a big sure. community out there, like SBC and like all the magazines out there. That was... It's huge. It's huge out there. But unfortunately down here, we don't, you don't see follow it, as much. it too yeah. much. You, know? you got the whole skateboarding epicenter right here. So you're not going right. to look into like what Canada's doing. No one gives a fuck what Canada's yeah. doing. <laughs> plus, plus, I was a skater that I just focused literally what you said. I was focused around what was in front of me. Yeah. I mean, it was like blind you know girl Geron. chocolate Jeron, all those guys so i wasn't really looking out too much for yeah. other shit you know what i mean yeah i mean i totally understand that but i think now we're at a point where we do start to pay attention to a degree oh, of 100%. what's going on around us in other countries because there is a that's lot so of great easy. media yeah go ahead that's just so easy yes yeah for sure yeah. Sorry, you have access no i mean this is your time <laughs> <laughs> um yeah. Yeah, it's easy now. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. That was fu- a good time back then. The magazines, when they were coming out, like when everyone just looked at the magazines, mm. it was only a couple of videos coming out. It was right. only a couple of magazines. I enjoyed looking at SBC. They had a really good magazine. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, but it was... Yeah. Are they still around? Was, who, TJ was talking about that when he was here. So. I don't think it's... Yeah. I think it's... It's it, not. Yeah, it's not. Mm. I think the only magazine that we have right now is... Was I it, don't even know. Was it mm-hmm. Color a, Magazine or Concrete? Color from there, yeah. King Shit? King Shit's not King a thing Shit's anymore. No? They took off Damn. the shit and then they just got rid of the whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> it was all downhill when they took the shit off. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, it's a shame, media. I mean, you know, it's different times. It'd be whatever. so sick if we went back to the era where it was just like 411s. Oh, mm. yeah. Or like, no, we should just do that shit again. But they just go out on YouTube instead. So obviously we're not all going to have like VCRs and shit. Yeah. Right. So like Jamming. mags and four one ones. So then people aren't just dumping all their content on Instagram because it's fucking horrible. Oh, I've been saying that for. <laughs> I mean, but you know what? It's such a. I mean, we feel like that. It's so hard, though. You know, to try to get everybody. To, we need like a electromagnetic pulse or something to fry everything. You know, start from scratch. Like, when's it gonna stop? When are we gonna get over this? <laughs> I don't I'm know. Because as soon as I, like Instagram comes along, I'm like. Well, Nothing can come around now. I mean, Instagram, ha- and then all of a sudden, TikTok's here, and then th- th- yeah, there's always something. Oh, I fucking watch TikTok. I have an account just to watch it, though. See? And I don't watch skating. I watch anything you else. Watch other <laughs> shit. <laughs> yeah. Like the fried shit. Yeah, th- I mean, they, that's what it's for. <laughs> Do you watch it? No, I just got it, but I could see myself getting sucked into this vortex. Oh, it's a hole. Yeah, I get like, scared <sighs> looking at stuff like that. It's like 2 a.m. You're like watching some kid crack an egg on his dad's head. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Exactly. Yeah. And the next thing is some random thing after that, and you just oh, they set you up. Yeah, oh, they, yeah. Put, they put some fucking shit in front of you. Like, the algorithm gets fucking crazy. It's insane. Yeah. You can you can curate that shit. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It's got the weird voices too. Oh yeah, that's becoming normal. You're right, Chris. You're gonna sneeze. Bless you. Oh, stopped. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, those, those, those little voices and now these little songs that are like so I don't know. Man, I yeah. just, it's getting up too much. You, you haven't made a TikTok video? No. <laughs> Oh, come on. <laughs> I think, wait, no, maybe one time. Oh, okay. But I didn't make it. My friend wanted us to do a TikTok together, so we did like a fucking TikTok dance. You danced. Oh, we danced. What did you dance? What was it? Do you know the name of the dance? Was it a thing? No, we just danced to the Miley Cyrus had like a whole song. Okay. Not the, rec- not the wrecking ball. No. Bro, it's like 2015. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> the wrecking thing. That's some old shit. Man. Okay. Yeah. I, I, I appreciate that, but no, man. Had like a whole, okay, okay. You know the Nine Inch Nails song? Um, she remade it, right? Yeah, she oh, remade she it. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. And me and my friend were just really obsessed with what it. What the hell does it do? I never understood these dances. What, what, what is the dance like? <laughs> 
look like a dad. I know right that. Now. I know that. <laughs> That's the way you said it. Is that good? I know the Macarena. You know, like, can we see it? <laughs> Give us a little Macarena, Chris. It's a Macarena. <laughs> Do you remember the Macarena? Do you hear about that? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I did that in school. Hi. <laughs> They yeah. did do that shit. <laughs> like a, you're the only person that I've ever heard think of that part of the song. Accentuates. Yeah. I like it. It's my favorite part of the song. Hey, Macarena. <laughs> Hi. All right. Oh, Holy that's shit. Cool. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> She's like, where the fuck am I? I don't know. So, so what was the dance? Can you show us the dance that you were doing? I don't I don't think it, no, it wasn't like that. We just fucking we just fucked around. Danced to the head like a hole. <laughs> okay. okay, okay. Well, we'll get off the Macarena and stuff. But uh <laughs> we were talking about getting sponsored and stuff. Now was like how where <laughs> I'm just trying to think because like you got on girl, what'd you say, like three years ago? Four years ago? Three and three years ago, something like that. Right? I think it was three years ago. Okay. How did that even happen? Did you have a sponsor before that? Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah, I wrote for Hoopla, Mimi Noops. Oh, oh, hell yeah. Oh, nice. Yeah. How was that? Oh, it was the best. That's, she's always, awesome. Always, she always like would send a box of boards and it would have like bearings, wheels, and grip in it. So you only had to worry about trucks. Oh, perfect. Yeah, it was awesome. And trucks, you know what, you, you get them once, once a year. Yeah, or something yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah, 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 chilling. So how did that even come about? There was this guy in Kelowna that had this company called Smarter Device, and he had some connection to S1. Okay. Yeah, and he was, like, a really nice dude, and he was, like, uh, I, you know, he's connected with S1, which is, like, doing Hoopla. So he's, like, I could connect you with Mimi New, who's doing this Hoopla thing. So I think he connected us, and we sent an email back and forth or some shit, and then, like, started getting Hoopla boards from Mimi. Yeah. She, without did she you didn't send her no, any footage nothing she just sent boards out of the just to, to hook you up i think that was just you know in, she's like oh, i looked at my instagram or some shit okay, oh, okay. some shit like that okay. oh, so okay. she did a little investigating well, i don't know yeah. maybe okay. Okay. <laughs> i can't speak for her but right all right. you know some boards showed that at your front door uh, yeah hell yeah. <laughs> yeah yeah perfect wait that so was... it's just i mean i know it sounds weird but there's instagram going around when you're coming up that is the only reason I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> See, like, like so, realistically. So, well, you you were posting your clips on your Instagram, and then it got seen by people. Yeah, like because remember Metrogram? Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Mm, they would repost. When I was in grade ten, I got Metrogrammed for the first time, and I remember being in fucking class. And like looking at it, I was like, oh shit, I just got Metro Grab. Like, <laughs> and like my phone was like blowing up on Instagram and I was like, whoa, this is fucking crazy. Okay, wow. wait, you got Metro Grammed. I mean, they, they were they were big Instagram. What yeah. happened to them? I, 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 I are they know. not around anymore? I don't know what happened. I actually they, don't know. They were around <laughs> for a while. But uh, what happened? Did you get uh, like a bunch of followers and stuff off of that? Yeah, I did. I, that just like happened a few times and I got like a bunch of followers. Where did you go wow. from that? Did you have like how many followers? Did you have like a couple hundred or a thousand to what? What did you get? Do you remember? It was in the thousands for sure. You got a, you got a couple thousand followers. Yeah, because I feel like by grade 12, I had like a lot of Instagram followers. Okay. Okay. Or like for the time, you know, like yeah, I definitely yeah, had the sure. most Instagram followers in my school. <laughs> maybe, maybe in Kelowna for all we what know. What was that? Kelowna, I was pulling. I was pulling. fucking pulling. <laughs> what was that like going to school when like you're like this famous Instagram person? Like, yeah, going, but I was. How many people, how many followers? Nobody in my school thought I was cool. <laughs> how many people? <laughs> yeah. you know, oh, there she probably bought her followers. Yeah. Huh? How many followers are we talking about? Do you remember? No, I don't. Okay. Remember. Okay. Like, oh, so like, was it like tens of thousands? or it was maybe like or... twelve thousand or something I mean, in the range that's pretty good for back then yeah. oh i was crushing it you were crushing it <laughs> <laughs> i never went to school with when social media no. was like that no. like how many followers you had no. were a thing it was so. just like you're a skater you're a football you're just you, yeah. you were just sec like it was just like that yeah god i couldn't imagine fucking growing up and having social media when I fucking graduated high school, it would be so bizarre. Yeah. Just because I was so used to that time of what we were doing at that time, you know what I mean? Mm. For sure. But I'm, I mean, I'm sure the same would be for you. If you didn't have fucking social media, you'd be like, how the fuck did you guys? I don't know. I don't know. how. But are you into social media? Do you fuck with it? Like, I think I like, did at like that it? time because it like you made were... me relevant as a skateboarder. Right. Mm. And that was like, all I did was skateboard. That's all I did. So I was like, I, that was really exciting for me at the time. But like, I don't love it. Right. 
If I could get rid of it now, I would. Gotcha. Yeah, you but that's on. like, you know, that is realistically what got me to this point. So it's like, yeah. For sure. Did yeah. you think that, that doing that was going to get you seen by people or were you just doing it because you were just... Well, it's like, you know, you get a phone and you're filming shit with your friends on your phone because now you got this phone that can film your, like, shit. Yeah. So, and then you're like, oh, I got somewhere to put it too. That's fun. And then and then after it, one time of getting Metrogram, then I was like, oh, I'm going to film, like, something good to put on my Instagram. Uh, yeah. There you go. And you kind of yeah. changed your mindset. Yeah. Like, okay, let me, mm, let me get Metrogram again. Yeah. yeah it yeah. sounds kind of <laughs> whack, but I guess that is, like, the no. reality. No, 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 no but it, it, it's... It, it, it's the course exactly. you know it's par for the course exactly you know? yeah and like i would never have been noticed being in that town from canada mm -hmm, if i didn't mm -hmm. have social media no and one would fucking totally. know i'm gonna tell you this i i discover a lot of skaters from instagram whether it be other accounts i discover uh men women i i mean it's it's great for that matter you know i do mm -hmm. follow those other not Metrogram, but you know what I mean? Those other Dude, ones that post a lot of he stuff. Heliclips used to be a good ah, Instagram account. There you account. go. Heliclips. When I got, when you get, Barracks obviously post a lot of stuff. Yep, yep, yep. But so, when you got Heliclipped. Yeah, you got, back then when you got Heliclipped. Oh, you got fucking, you were like 10,000 followers. Yeah. Kelly's like, yeah. <laughs> but that's when you got those reposts like that. That was a yeah, big thing. It was. It yeah. was. Yeah. Yeah. It still is. I mean, if you get a Thrasher repost, still to this oh, day. Yeah. I'm still waiting for that Thrasher repost. You know what I'm saying, bro? <laughs> I've gotten one or two. Should we just all DM Thrasher some Chris Roberts, Chris Re Fuck clips that. right now? Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. I don't think they've posted me one time. And I love Thrasher. <laughs> My big fan, Where's big fan clips? of everybody that works there. Yeah. Oh, I got to get some clips. Oh yeah, maybe that's, yeah. Maybe, okay. <laughs> oh, that's gonna help. That's a, big time. That's a problem. Just post a photo of Chris on the Instagram for the Thrasher Instagram. Well, I'll, photo I'll tag Thrasher. Yeah. I'll pose for a portrait. And easy. Yeah. You know, <laughs> they want to repost for that, huh? Yeah, I'll just send it to him direct. They could be the. They could have an exclusive. <laughs> hey, if you Burnett, if you want to post this, it's all good. I mean, I would be honored. You know? <laughs> yeah. Just kidding. Uh, so you got Metrogrammed. That's amazing. And then so so Mimi was hooking you up with boards. Yeah. How long did that last for? Were you on there for a while? Did you ever get put on or was it just flow? I don't know what I was. Okay. Okay. <laughs> was that confusing was, to you? No, it wasn't. I was just getting you boards. Just getting hoopla. boards. Okay. I think I was like on. I like filmed a little hoopla video for it. Okay. Like welcome to the team hoopla. I guess that means so that you were on. on. Yes, yeah. that yeah. definitely means. Was that on an Instagram or YouTube or where did that come out? That came out on YouTube. YouTube, okay. Yeah. Okay, on their YouTube channel. Yeah. Yeah, you're wrong. Oh, definitely. Yeah, I was fucking yeah. on. You're but right. The, I just didn't know. <laughs> but so there was no discussion. There was no like she didn't call you and be like, hey, we want to put you on the team. Why don't you film a video? I just don't remember. You don't remember? Okay. I, How old were you at this point? Fifteen. Fifteen. Wow. This is like three years after you, you started skating. That's great. Sometimes it happens fast. I know. I know. Yeah. So, welcome video comes out. You're on the team. Does the board package increase? You get more boards? <laughs> <laughs> Listen, it's a big deal. No, it was fine. I don't know. Okay. Uh, fuck, I don't know, man. I don't remember. I don't think anything changed. <laughs> Nothing changed. I think I was just getting a nice box every time. Perfect. <laughs> Were they just showing up or did you call her or email her? Like, hey, I need some more I boards. Think I, would, you mind I think I would hit her up. Okay. And then she'd send them to the board shop. Who were you filming with back then? Oh, we had like actually the funnest shit going on at that point in time. Cause like, <laughs> don't, no, listen here. No. <laughs> um, I went to church when I was younger mm -hmm. and the pastor of the church I went to had a kid that skateboarded. His name was Ryan. He's one of my really good friends growing up. And he wrote for bakery, the bakery board shop too, mm. which is the board shop I was writing for at that point. And the guy that owned it was like, you guys want to film a video? And we were all like, yes, we want to film a fucking video. Okay. So this, this kid, Ryan, skated. He was really good, but he also had a video camera. So he started filming this video. And then there was a couple other kids around our age that we knew that were from like farther out in town, but we were friends with. We would all meet at like, the good skate park was like in Kelowna. Mm. So we'd all meet there. Yeah, so there's just like a few of us that like started filming this video for the bakery. Okay. And then we filmed this video called... Baker's dozen. Baker's dozen. <laughs> nice. Was there a dozen of you? There was potentially a dozen. <laughs> of us. Okay. Give or take. A, give or take. Give or take yeah, one yeah. or two. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Baker's dozen. So, so like, yeah, we just started filming for that. 
I don't remember where this conversation started. Yeah. <laughs> but you were, that's who you were filming with. Yeah, that's who we yeah. were filming with. Yeah. Okay. You had a part in that video. I did. Ah. Yeah, we mm. all, everyone that rode for the board shop had a part in that video. Nice. Were you, were you stoked on your part? At the time? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's, it was all right. Yeah, it was okay. Okay. <laughs> and there so were some things I was stoked on. And right. you were not on Hoopla at that point yet. No, I was on Hoopla. Oh, you were? Uh, yeah, okay. Yeah. So you're sent, did you show them that clip? What did they think about that? I was already on. Uh, yeah, and then so they saw it, and then they were like, "Cool, <laughs> <laughs> perfect, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a good answer, nice good answer, good shit." Yeah. So, then how long after? So you said you're 15 at this point when you're getting when you're getting boards from Hoopla, right? Yeah. How how long did that last? Did it go from Hoopla to getting on like Girl Flow, or how did that? What was what was going on in between there? Um, it was actually I was on Hoopla for a few years. Okay. Okay. Because. Okay. I love that she laughs every time she's going <laughs> to yeah. tell the story. Yeah. She's like, oh, it's kind of I don't know where I'm starting and I don't know where <laughs> it's going. <laughs> I got on Hoopla when I was 15 uh-huh. and then finished high school, moved down to Vancouver when I was 17. Ah, the move to Vancouver. Yeah. Mm. Why'd you move to Vancouver? At 17 as well. One of my older sisters lived there. So I lived on her couch for two months before I found a place. Got nice. you. Got you. And then I started working for a distribution that distributed red dragons okay. Oh. okay and i was riding for the red dragons there you go and getting converse mm. so i had like some shit going on and okay. i was like okay i need to move to vancouver now i'm out of school i have a job lined up with this distribution that i also ride for so i'm fucking chilling wow so i went moved down there still on hoopla okay doing that was Mo- did moses do the distribution he did he still does it oh sick yeah. so that's who you're working for yes oh he wasn't nice my immediate boss but he was technically like the boss boss the boss the yeah. boss of all bosses he, is, he, he, is the bo- the boss. he was the boss of all bosses front mm-hmm. nose boss oh yeah. Shout, yeah. shout out <laughs> yeah. Moses. Yeah. Yeah. Shout yeah. out Hell yeah. Yeah. Legend. so now you you moved to vancouver 17 living on your sister's couch mm-hmm. working at the distribution i mean you like you said you had things going on this is great <laughs> oh, moving yeah. up in the world were you skating ambleside at all oh you Oh, you like Ambleside. I eh? love Ambleside. <laughs> I went there before they remodeled it, though. Oh, yeah, yeah. 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 When it was, like, in videos and shit, now it's, like, an actual, like, seaside nice skate park. It looks mm. great. I went there for Come the... Long way. I went there for the Go Skate Day um, fundraiser that they had there. They had a fundraiser to, to build the new park or remodel it. Oh, when yeah. was that? I don't know, the year before they remodeled it. I don't, <laughs> I don't remember. I don't know when that I don't was. Know. <laughs> me, and, me and Mark Johnson went up there. Oh, it was so fun. So fun. Cool. So now you're okay. So what happened now? Because are you going to get on another company? You're going to still ride for Hoopla? What was going on at that point when you moved to Vancouver? So I was working at that distribution, mm-hmm. and then Tony Vitello hit me up to film a Thrasher part at some point while I was working there. Amazing. And during wow. filming that, Hoopla dismantled like it ended. Oh, okay. So. <laughs> Wait a minute. It's like getting a little uncomfortable. Why? Why? You're not talking about this stuff? I'm just Yeah, no, no, no. no. Oh. I'm just getting a little awkward. Hold on. Oh, <laughs> Kelly, calm down over there. <laughs> <laughs> Listen. Um, <laughs> so, so. No, we're just trying to figure out the timeline. That's yeah, no, all, me you know? too. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, that's great. That's great. Don't, don't worry about it. That happens, worry about a lot it. of people come on the show. They're like, wait, what? what oh, yeah. What did I do at that point? Oh, yeah, it happens God. all the time. The timeline I, can be thrown off. It quite can. A bit, it's a sure. lot. It's a lot. Yeah. Because sometimes things happen so quick. It's a whole thing. But uh, so Tony asked you to film this part. That's a c- incredible. Oh, yeah. And then, okay. So I started filming that part. And I think like right before or as Hoopla ended. Stop being a thing. Mm. Isn't and, Hoopla still going though? No. It's not anymore. No, it ended like then. Got you. Okay. Okay. Five years ago. Five years ago. 2018, 19, something like that. No, 17. 18. Yeah. I think 18? 18. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So <laughs> if if Hoopla, so when Hoopla is dismantling, I told you, calm down, Kelly. <laughs> <laughs> she went. She started burping. I decided. Oh, I guess yeah. I'm fucking burping. <laughs> so what did you do when Hoopla dismantled? You just said, oh, I'm not going to get boards anymore. Wait, was there anything going on at the distribution? Well, I just like they were like, yeah, you can just skate our boards, obviously, like, skate whatever we have, and they had. NHS, oh. flip, skate metal and shit. Perfect. So I just picked flip. Okay. So I was just skating flip boards. And that was cool. 
I tried really hard to get on Toy Machine, and by really hard, I got one person to send one email. That was it. Hard as fuck. <laughs> they did not. They, they didn't reply. <laughs> you got one person to send one email. Yeah, Michelle Pizzell at any social sent an email to Ed, and he didn't fucking answer me. No. Oh, look who you missed out on, dude. I <laughs> know, Ed. <laughs> Just kidding, oh, dude. Dude. It all works out for the you know. It all so works you're out, a big man. fan of Toy Machine. That was like the company I wanted to get on. God, gotcha. dude, Alyssa, a, like, really I'm sorry to interrupt yeah. you. Uh, just no. so I can remember this, uh, there was a clip I saw you. I think you hard flipping a set of stairs, and you're are you wearing a toy machine shirt in the clip? No, it's something else. It's oh, an antisocial shirt that did a collab with Toy Machine. Oh, okay. So it was like Michelle definitely loves Toy Machine too, and she mm. was like did the collab with them. And I loved it too. <laughs> That's but wait okay. a minute, at this time you said that she sent an email. Why not just like a, a DM? I mean, Instagram was going on at this time, right? Did they even have? Yeah. I think email's a little more professional. I don't even think Michelle yeah. had a fucking iPhone. She only had her home phone. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. <laughs> she was very. I think she got her first iPhone like two years ago. Jeez. That's how she runs it. <laughs> That's how she rolls. So, Ed didn't respond. Okay. Well. And then, so you just kept riding those boards? Yeah, I was the, just skating them at the, mm, the distro and then okay. kind of was like, kind of wanted to get on flip. Did you like hit him up? Remember, I know Matt like called me at some point saying some shit, but. Matt. Berger. Matt Berger, mm. nice. But Matt, I, Matt's in Van, he's in Vancouver, he's in Vancouver as well, right? No, he's down no. here, he's but down he's, here. Fr he's from Canada. Yeah, he's, he's from, from outside Canada. Vancouver, right? Or something yeah. down there? He's, he's been out here for days. He's, but I just, yeah. Just, yeah. Whatever, backtracking. Mm. Yeah. At this point in time, also, how many, uh, or who, who was you getting shoes from? I was getting shoes from Converse. Okay. I think at that point, though, they also ended the Canadian team. Uh, so it was like kind of like ending a bunch of shit at once. Oh, that's disheartening. Yeah. And they like. So Hoopla and Converse done. Yeah, they kind of like finished like near the same time. Mm. And then Matt was like, yeah, I heard you wanted to get on flip. Like, we could get you flip boards. But like, right as that was happening, too, all the girl dudes came to town. Okay. And they came and did a demo at Strathcona Skate Park. I don't know if you guys know that one. Mm, nah, you don't. If I saw a video of it, probably, but. Yeah. Uh. It's like the opening to the anti, the OG anti-social video. They do like like a team line at that park. I don't remember I don't that know, clip. I don't remember. You wouldn't remember it, but just so you know. Okay. <laughs> All, right. That's a reference. All right, cool. So they did a demo there. Yeah, and then I just met them all, and I just kept taking selfies with Beeble. <laughs> okay. Okay. I thought it was like really funny to keep asking Beeble to take a selfie with me. Did and he remember you every time, or was he? I don't even know. <laughs> <laughs> you know, Beeble was probably like, "Yeah." He's like, "Sure, yeah." He was yeah. like, "Sure." Yeah. Yeah. And then there was a party at Soch that night. I don't even remember what for, okay. but we were there. And I obviously asked him to take another selfie with me. And right. I was drunk, too. So I was like, "Come on, I'll take a nice selfie." <laughs> <laughs> How many selfies do you think you got with him that day? Honestly, it was probably only like three, but in my mind, I was like this on a, a selfie mission. So I was like, like, I was this like I'm is, doing a good job like, right this now. This is hilarious. <laughs> like, oh my God. Um, and then he was like, no, like, let's take a good photo. Like here, like step in my hands. And I was like, what? So I like put my feet in his hands. Okay. No, wait. First, he took a photo of me and somebody else in his arms. I was sitting <laughs> on his arm. I remember this. And some, someone else yeah. was sitting here. I remember seeing these photos somewhere. And he was like holding you guys up? Yeah. <laughs> it's like, daddy. <laughs> <laughs> and then, I guess, yeah, I forgot I had asked for that one. I asked him for another one. And he was like, okay, like put your feet in my hands. So I like stepped on his hands and he was like, okay, get ready, ready. I'm going to lift you up. He starts lifting me up and he's like, hold on to my shoulders. And I was like, okay, hold on to his shoulders. And then he like literally lifted me above I his fucking head <laughs> with his arms, just his arms. And I'm fully standing up. You're like cheerleader and shit. Yeah, yeah. I was fucked. <laughs> That's so amazing. I was like kind of drunk too. So I was like trying to like crouch a little because I was like, I don't know if I'm I gonna, have this right now. It's going to fall. Yeah, yeah it's kind of sketchy. Dude, Beeble's... Oh he's the god. That's wow. life of the party, man. Yeah, for I sure. remember seeing those photos somewhere. Maybe they did like a montage of all the photos from that tour Might or something. Yeah. yeah, maybe. Or did you post it on your Instagram, possibly? I definitely posted, you posted it. <laughs> okay, okay. So you met all the girl guys. Yeah, and I think that solidified hmm. the that they would ask me to come in the van. Okay. 
<laughs> no, I don't know. I don't know what fucking happened. But they asked me to come in the van the next day on mm. a trip with them up to Squamish and Whistler. Oh, because wait, were you friends with McCrank at this point in time also? I knew McCrank. You knew McCrank. Okay. You skate with them at all? I, I mean, obviously you antisocial shop yeah. and everything. Okay. So you had the stamp from McCrank too. Potentially. I don't yes. know. <laughs> well, I mean, I'm just thinking in my head like... On tours, we wouldn't just ask anybody to jump in the van with no. us unless they had like a stamp or was affiliated with. You know what I mean? Like we wouldn't just word of mouth, anything. Yeah, that's yeah gonna something. Be like okay, yeah, let's like let's yeah, get them in the van. Bring it, bring yeah. yeah, get in the van. Mm -hmm. You know. Yeah. No, I knew it was like a thing. Right. I was like, oh shit. Yeah, <laughs> get in the van. <laughs> so were you nervous at this point? You're going up to skate. Where were you going to go skate? We were Did going you know... up to Squamish and Whistler for a day trip. Okay, Squamish. Dude, the best names I in Canada, names. dude. Trust me. <laughs> Did you guys make it over to Saskatoon? Oh, listen, we'll talk about that later. But uh, how? What, what? What spots are up there that you went? Do you remember the spots? It's a demo. It was or? more of like a fucking chill time. Okay. Like there's a skate park in Squamish, and there's a skate park in Whistler. That's it. Gotcha. And then it's like a lot of nature. Like we went swimming. We went on a like rope swing in the little lake and stuff. Rad. It was it was like more chilling, and then we just like skated those two parks. Okay, okay. So after they left, that was cool. You did your thing. Did you hear from anything? Like, what did you? Were you like, oh man, I could maybe get on girl skateboards? Like, what was going through your head at that point? <laughs> kind of that, but then I also was like, I'm not gonna expect that because I don't know. Maybe we're just kicking it. <laughs> gotcha, gotcha. Right, right. Or maybe okay. they're not fucking down. Right. But. Uh, yeah, no, Rick hit me up a couple days later and was like, do you want some boards? And I was like, oh, I'm fucking in. <laughs> <laughs> so dumb. Wow. Rick McCrank hit you up. Rick oh, Rick Howard. Howard. Oh, Howard. Howie. Howie. Ooh. Good old Howie hit me. Pretty dog. sure. Okay. Dude, I was like, seeing Rick Howard's name in my phone, I was like, oh, that was fucking sick. <laughs> yeah, that was, yeah. That's so rad. Wow. So he started giving you boards. Yeah. Amazing. And I was like, flip? No, nah, I'm good. <laughs> You're saying, sorry, sorry. So are they now sending them directly to your house or through the skate shops or through the distribution? I get it sent to Soch because okay, okay. it's too much. I don't know. It's too much to get it sent to my house and never there. By the way, yeah. shout out Antisocial. Shout out. They, uh, they are shout out Antisocial. Yes. Fucking great, great skate shop up there. Been holding it down for dumb long. Hell yeah. Know, right? Love yeah, Michelle's shit. the best. So you thought to yourself you're in. This is good. I'm <laughs> <laughs> but you're like, you're just getting flowed boards at this point, right? No, I'm just getting flowed boards. Now. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, but that's, listen, that's, no, that's a big that's deal. Huge. That's, that's a big deal, real talk. That's, that's huge. That's what were you now thinking in your head? Were you like, oh, okay, I got a film now. Like, how do I get on this company? Do I just keep talking to Howard or McCrank or what was going on there? Or were you just skating? I don't think I did anything different. No, you just were doing your thing, which is great. And it's this beautiful. Is, this is before that Thrasher part came out, so or in the middle of it? Yeah, I think in the middle because I was skating flipboards partially in that video, mm. but not the whole time. Okay. Huh. So what, when the Thrasher part came out, is that when they kind of asked you to? Uh, No. No? I was flow until I went on Am Scramble. Mm. I think during that portion, like like right before, right after, obviously I can't fucking remember. <laughs> <laughs> like somewhere around there, I I they turned me M or something. Okay, okay. No, they did. How did or something? <laughs> how did that happen? Fuck. Did who called you? Did they say we want to put you on the squad? Or? I was in town and we went and shot photos with playback. A mate, playback's great. Yeah, man. the best. Yeah. so yeah. sick. Yes. So he, they they were in town again. What'd you say? They were... I was down here. Oh, you were down here. Yeah, and they okay. were doing a thing with playback. Ah. Is that when Drawn, you did something with him too at yeah, the same time? I think that's probably around the time we were doing that, that ad campaign where they were a very tight knit in like, you know, close yeah. shots. They were doing all the 90s like, yeah. style yeah, photos. Yeah, exactly. Mm. And that's oh, yeah. right at playback fucking yours? alley. Uh, I did a heel flip over this little bar thing, whatever. That, But I hadn't been skating for a while and... Yeah, Is that the one that your face? You didn't like your face? My face was crazy. Like whatever. <laughs> <laughs> like it's, you didn't like what his face You know, face that happens, like. you know, where you get a shot. Everybody and you're just hates like, to eh. see their own face. Yeah. You're I always know. looking fucking nasty. Yeah. Yeah. Especially skating. You're in yeah. mid-trip. Yeah. Like, yeah, exactly. Fucking, Has anyone had like a nice looking, like just like a nice smile or something? I feel like <laughs> people who are like <laughs> graceful <laughs> on their boards, like maybe 
like Rojo or you know what I mean those like stylish Dylan dudes or something Dylan, like that. Yeah, yeah, with just the still ass mellow face yeah. like okay yeah. that was mellow for you cool. <laughs> like, this is cool man <laughs> I like people that stick out their tongues though when they do take a photo. A shot. Like, a shot. Yeah, Sean yeah. does Shad that. Does it a lot? Or like oh, he a does that. Definitely does. Yeah, that. yeah. Who else does it? Is there anybody? I like can think of a thing, but I can't think of the person. The but I can yeah. picture someone being like. Yeah, I always think yeah. of Shad for some reason. 100%. He he always goes like this. Yeah, yeah. he's yeah. got the when he's rolling up to a. Uh, he's got the, yeah, little jerk. I like kid. it though. Yeah, I think it's cool. It works. It, I think that's might be his concentration point. Oh yeah, I just like half laughing at yourself sure. i used to think sure. that yeah. Yeah. for sure stefan janoski used to have like a funny face but i like the way it looked mm. in, in, i don't know if that makes any sense but he I was seems like, like he's smiling and shit yeah he just had like this look on it but it wasn't i don't know it's just interesting yeah just it stood out to me but one of my favorite skaters so you get on girl officially well you were out here now did they who did they how did the, how did this conversation go this is what i'm wondering you need some water (laughs) (laughs) what what is so funny (laughs) I just zoned out for like so long like the whole time you were talking about Stefan Janowski yeah, sorry, I just spaced. Sorry, no, yeah. I just zoned out, and then I was still zoned out. I told him to relax. I <laughs> oh, I just said, how did they ask you? How did they ask you to get on? I mean, how did they? How did they put you on? Did they just say, hey, you're on? Oh man, I don't remember. You don't remember? Well, how was going on the AM scramble thing? Oh, the AM scramble's great. That was fucking crazy. Which year was the AM scramble you went on? Just before COVID hit. Oh, okay. Yeah, like got you. Got you. Huh. It was really intimidating. It was so fun, though. Like, we all definitely became friends. Who was on that one? I can't remember. Uh, Gage Boyle, Griffin Gass, Jack O'Grady, Jacopo? Oh, yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. okay. Um, it's a heavy squad. Beanwater, Jesse. Um, I mean, those AM scrambles are always crazy. They're fucking. They got yeah. the fucking best best AMs on there. They, they choose wisely. That's for so sure. you, were you were you at first you were intimidated, and then you just kind of relaxed. It was intimidating the whole time. I just accepted that I was drinking on that trip. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I was like, I'm just fucking. I'm just the van squad. <laughs> perfect. Perfect. Was uh, Fabiana on that too? No, she was on the year before. Oh, that's mm. what it was. Okay. Yeah, they got the one girl. This year they got Susie Heath. Okay. Oh yeah. You heard about that girl? I saw her recently. I was. She, wait, she's the Australian, or no? No, she's from California, I think, or she resides. Hmm. Blast uh, the big air. Oh, she's a vert I think skater. She can do it all. Oh really? Yeah. ATV, huh? Mm-hmm. ATV right Damn. there. Damn, that's sick. I'm always jealous of ATVs. Hell yeah. Fuck. I was just, I just grew up in the streets. I couldn't do the transition. No, 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 no. not at all. Huh? Nothing. Damn. Ron, what can you do on a quarter pipe? <laughs> I can do some shit. Oh, but yeah. I can't do that much. Shit. He can do some shit. I can for do sure. some shit though. Yeah. No, I believe it. I believe it. Yeah, no, I'm just, <laughs> I like she has. Check my chat, Greg. No, I'm just Doug, <laughs> got, listen, Doug uh, got some. He's, I got some. Got some well shit, but I'm not like. Well I'm not like I could put a run together. Like I can't put a full like fucking a minute run together or some shit. Oh, but I no. could. I have like you know. I could put like. I could hit the wall like five times comfortably. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's all we're asking for. <laughs> you know. Um, but Griffin Gas was on that trip too. Yeah. So girl rider. Did you bro down with them? Oh, we bro down all right. Yeah? Amazing. Just getting drunk with me. <laughs> That's yeah. tight. It's like we a good time. I know. We were not doing shit. That's I a... think he got two clips. I think I got three clips. Like <laughs> Okay. Beat him out. At least you got something. No, yeah, that's true. Oh, that's wrong. That's he got three clips too. Oh. I wasn't trying to say. Uh, I'm tired. Dude. Jack O'Grady though, he's out of he's out of control. Yeah, he's fucked. Yeah, he's no, some early shit. Fucked. <laughs> <laughs> like, well, those trips so he, are like designed to go to like the gnarliest spots, almost, mm. right? Yeah, no, it's rad. It's so rad to watch. But I was almost like, what am I doing here? <laughs> yeah. I think I'm just here to kick it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna be selective on what I see here and what I skate. Griffin Gas is amazing too. Yeah, that boy can skateboard. He is gnarly. But it's like you bring Griffin. Oh, I'm sorry, Griffin Gas. Like a, these crazy spots, he probably won't shine as much as he would at like his a spot that he likes to skate. You know what I mean? He's right. more tech. Yeah, in a way. yeah, yeah, for sure. 
So sure. sometimes I think those he could get down though, right? He's, he's, he he could get oh, down. Oh, he could definitely yeah. get down for sure. He chucked his little carcass down. Did he? <laughs> 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 yeah, for sure. I always remember the year that like was it Jamie Foy and like Zion and those dudes. That was like the gnarliest year because they were going to like everyone was skating like the gnarly stuff. Mm, That's yeah. the crazy thing about it though because everyone's just like that year was so fucked. Yeah. Nobody <laughs> can do that. No. It's never going to be the same. Yeah, sure. it's like it's a tough one for sure. Yeah, that was a special special year for that. Bars hot, set high, you know. But oh, I, don't, I don't know. There's so many amazing AMs nowadays, you Dude, know. I think then no matter what the AM scramble, like that year was crazy. But these AMs, they put it down. It's insane. New breeds, man. Oh. No joke. Girl and fucking guys, straight up across the boards. It's oh, yeah. bananas. So how long were you on flow for? Like a year and a half, maybe. Yeah, I'm counting the years. Yeah, so yeah, many years yeah. to count, you know? Mm-hmm. Probably like a year and a half or something. A year and a half. Okay. Yeah. And then when they put you on, you have to remember this. How yeah. did this happen? Did they call you? Was it a, a whole thing? Because I know how they turned you pro. We'll get into that too. But what about getting on? <laughs> what is on? No, but sometimes they, you're just on and, and they don't, there's was, not like a big deal. That's true. It was too. chill. They were just like, like, take, like, shoot this photo. You're going to have an ad. And then I was like, Oh, well, that obviously means I'm on. And then okay. I think Megan was like, we're going to pay you. And I was like, okay. Now then, I'm on. Now I'm really in. <laughs> now you're For in. Sure. Yeah. How, I, oh, I'm sorry. Go ahead. I was just going to say, when they started paying you, were you still working at the distribution? Was I? Because <laughs> then you could have. No, I, mean, I was for sure still working there. I'm trying to think like how, because uh, I've never lived in Vancouver, obviously. But I, I imagine that it's, it's, it's somewhat pricey to live out there, you know? It's like the same prices here. It's the same prices here. But it's like here. Canadian money. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. It's like for sure. Ways. Loonies sure. and toonies. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, that was 2019. Okay, 2019. Right. I think I quit my job December of 2019, maybe. Mm, okay. To skate full time. Yeah, I think Van started to pay me a little bit. Oh. So I was like, I quit my job right after that maybe fuck i don't remember right now because uh, like i was saying the price of living definitely depends on you know if you have roommates how yeah. much you're getting paid how many sponsors you have this totally. that and the other you 1, know percent. so vans how did vans even come into the picture um i think like geo over at vans canada was like asked michelle if i wanted to ride for vans and i was like no i ride for cons okay. they said they were gonna put me on the american team but they didn't. They just never fucking answered me. Wow. They just never answered my text. Okay. <laughs> so but they, they told answer, me they were gonna. Yeah, if like, they don't answer your text or do any of that shit, then you have free reign to do what the fuck you want. That's yeah. true. <laughs> right? That's yeah, true. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. They hit up um, Ashley. What would you say? <laughs> <laughs> He, you're good. At, you're good at the names, but yeah. yeah. Are you sure you haven't been drinking, yeah. Chris? The no, fuck? he's usually good at that. Did I hear the name Ashley at all? I said Michelle. Michelle. Oh, Michelle. Michelle. <laughs> there it is, Michelle. That's close. Yeah, close to Ashley. It's like the basic name. You mean? I mean, listen, right? <laughs> it's a basic. So name. they hit. They hit up Michelle yeah, to get you like, on. I was like, "Fuck no! I'm right for God." <laughs> You turned him down at first. I don't think, I don't know. I don't even know who I said that to, but then cons never fucking answered me. So I like, I was like, to this guy at my work, I was like, hey, what the fuck do I do? Like, should I like email Vans? So I like emailed Bob LaSalle, sent him like this really fucking weird email telling him why he should move on Vans. You know, yeah, wait a minute, wait a minute. Yeah. <laughs> they already yes. asked if I would be on and I was like, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Like, I was just so fucking awkward. I was like, I'm just going to send Bob this weird <laughs> email being like, hey, sh- can you put me on the Vans? He probably loved that, to be honest. Bob's a funny ass dude. Yeah, he's, <laughs> yeah. A, he's a weirdo. <laughs> did he? Did, he, did that, so, that work? Yeah. Did yeah. He was, well, like, clearly, I'm <laughs> <on the dance. laughs> Yes. Amazing. So he replied to the email and started sending you shoes. Yeah. But it's incredible. And then I went to the House of Vans in Calgary. Mm. Please try again. There, there it is. is. There it is. Fucking hate Siri. What does she do for you? Nothing. <laughs> She interrupts my conversations. She does it quite she often. Does. She does. Fuck. So you went to Calgary. You went to the House of Vans in Calgary. Yeah, that was sick. Yeah. You know that's where they made the Caesar. What do you mean the Caesar? Caesar salad. Fuck sakes. <laughs> uh, it's like the Canadian Bloody Mary. 
Oh. Mm. A little spicier. We don't have that What's down it? here. We don't have, yeah. we have a Caesar. <laughs> yeah. we got I know. Caesar's. I just keep saying dumb shit that I'm like, this is well, not No, nah, you're not. Oh, it's we not, not dumb. No, we, just, we don't know it. Yeah, so we don't, like we're poutine, you know. That's like along those lines. <laughs> okay. Okay. It's like only in Canada. Yeah, they made the Caesars there. Okay. That's What's in the Caesar? That's part of the yeah, whole thing. <laughs> do they still put a stick of celery in there? They What's, do. Okay. I don't even know what the difference is. Mm. The Worcestershire sauce? Oh, they make well, That's it, probably mm. what it is. You're saying they make it spicier. They yeah. use clamato juice. Don't Cl- Bloody Mary's? Clamato? Clamato? Clamato. Clamato. Uh, clamato. clamato. Raj, don't they use that in Bloody Mary's? <laughs> no. Oh. At least not on mine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they use clamato juice. Oh, no. Not in mind. Yeah. So, Cal- Calgary. <laughs> <laughs> Got a Caesar. Yeah, nice. I don't even know where that came in. That's just exciting. <laughs> well, I love it, man. You got to shout it out. The highlights. You yeah. got to shout out the, the Canadian things. You know what I'm saying? You don't even know. TJ Rogers brought all of us candies and different things that we can't chip. The tomato. Uh, chips. Oh, you guys don't have ketchup chips. Yeah. 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 Wait, do we still have those? Like, no, no, we, I ate them. He took, no, he took that shit back with him. Oh, he took it back. Yeah, that's yeah. right. What do you bring? Oh, Henry's? Did he bring? I was o- just oh, gonna Henry's. say, you don't have Oh Henry's? You don't have Coffee Crisp? <laughs> no. Oh, that's what he brought. Though. I like the Coffee. Coffee crisp. Crisps are fucking good. Yeah, we do have Oh Henry's here, though. I believe. I At think certain we do. places, we yeah, do, we do like, the yellow packaging, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, we do have that. So Central made a whole selective stores, but it's not like yeah, it's not. As much like Snickers, you would see. No, 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 no. no. Snickers, no, has, Snickers has the the market down here. It's cornered. Are you a Tim Hortons fan? I used to love Tim Hortons until what happened? I'm vegan now, so I can't eat anything there. Oh, but the sour cream glazed donut fucking slaps. What? Sour cream glazed donut. No, it's fucking good. I swear. You guys can come up to Canada. You can try it. It's real nice. It's so it's a glazed good. donut with sour cream cream on it. Is that pretty much? I don't know why it's called that. Mm. Maybe it's part of the glazing process. Oh, okay. Mm. Okay. It's nice and heavy. I love that. I love sour cream. It's a heavy little donut. I love donuts. <laughs> why? I love that. Why? Uh, why vegan? Animals oh, man, or health or shit. what? I, I mean, I... is this is this new? Is it new? No, I mean, have you been like vegan for quite some time? Yeah, I've been vegan for like three years, but okay. I've mm. gone. I only ate some pizza once or twice. Oh, you, yeah. so, you, 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 little che- you cheated a little bit. I cheated a little okay. bit. That's yeah. okay, though. No, I've been Listen. vegan for like three years, though. Um, it's better for the planet. Yeah? yeah? Animals. I love animals, you know, and it breaks my heart to eat them, but they're delicious. <laughs> <laughs> That'll piss some people off. Yeah, that definitely will, huh? <laughs> Kind of We're having fun here, guys. Come on. She hates plants. Um, What's your favorite chicken? kind of animal? I like chicken. Eat, yeah? yeah, chicken's great. You know, what I'm kind, not a big what part of the chicken. Steak. Oh, uh, the, the the breast. Yeah. Yeah. Or uh, the Some thigh. Nice white breast. White meat. Yeah, for sure. Good. Steak's good too. Do you miss eating meat or anything? Or are you totally content with what? I mean, you said like you say, you a little che- cheated here. A little cheese here and there. Cheated here. And there. Oh. Yeah, cause, but only because I was drunk and, you know, like, <laughs> nothing was open and I was like, I got to fucking eat something. So I had a piece of pizza. Okay. That's eh, good. No, no, I, you know. And that shit probably tasted so fire. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I kind of fuck with vegan cheese, though. Mm? I really do, but. Mm. Vegan cheese is interesting texture. You got to find a good one. Yeah, but that, that, yeah, that's a thing. Is there's a lot of good yeah, stuff out there. Definitely. You just got to find sure. it. For yeah. For sure. Because there's a lot of bad stuff out there too. Well, it's the thing. It's like I'll I'll, I'll I'll put majority down majority is bad. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> but I'll, I'll yeah, put down some like <laughs> right. No, you just speak. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But uh, facts. <laughs> I'll put down <laughs> facts. Yeah. <laughs> I'll put down gluten free stuff. I'll put down vegan stuff. Like I'm I'll, I'll eat anything. But it's you got to find that right spot or the right product for sure. Yeah. For sure. Do you find it hard on trips to like find certain places to eat? Uh, yeah, it's so fucking annoying on trips. It's just like a side of fries and a side salad, but like. I feel like on trips, though, sometimes I'll go to like Whole Foods. Like, that's a big stop now. Right. But that's only in if you're in America. Yeah. Yeah. When you go anywhere else, it's like uh, a true. bitch. That's true. 
Yeah, that's but there true. ain't no Whole Foods in like the middle of no like fucking middle America. Oh, that's true. They're, they're, yeah, that's true I mean, on a skate trip, we'd be like, oh, let's just go to McDonald's real quick. Yeah, crack like, whatever. Barrel, whatever. And that's the fucking worst. Yeah, but well, now I'm thinking. I'm, when I was in it, fucking twenty years ago, like, let's go. Fucking, yeah, yeah, yeah. All day, but now I'm just like that. Shit I mean, sucks. here in LA, like California, it's easy to find that stuff. It's yeah. so chill. It's so chill. Yeah. But like Ed, when Ed was doing that back in the day, it's probably fucked. You know, no. like oh, then. Yeah. Hell yeah. He was the first. V- like vegan skateboard I could think of that I heard of back in the day we went on a 1000% like I, were oh. you there were you there when we went on a trip Aaron Smith I believe he was vegan at the time I felt I'm so sure. bad for him because we were going through cross country trip I don't remember what it was, I don't think it was a- poor guy he would always just go eat by himself he would always go he had an app he'd find the closest little vegan spot and he would venture off where we parked the van yeah and I just felt bad because he'd always have to venture off alone. And he'd come back. He'd be like, how's your meal? I'm like, good. How was your meal? Where'd you go? It was in, you know, it's like, yeah. fuck. Make it happen. Sucks you didn't have a buddy for it. I know. Right. Hey, wait, Kenny, though. Kenny. Anderson. This was before. Oh, this Kenny's was like back big. in the day. On the Instagram, he's posting all the fucking good stuff he's hitting. Bro, yeah, he's yeah, nuts yeah, yeah, with yeah. it for sure. In the, in the best <laughs> way. He grows shit at the house I know, stuff, right? Bro, he yeah. How is the, uh, the vegan scene up there in... Um, in Vancouver. You got Vugan, uh, vegan poutine up there? Vugan. <laughs> Vugan. Vugan. Vugan poutine. Vugan poutine. <laughs> oh, yeah. My favorite spot's gone now, though. What was it called? The Black Lodge. It was like a Twin Peaks-themed restaurant. It was Amazing. so fucking good. Mm. Did you ever watch the Twin Peaks? Old old no, school show? Oh, watch shit. You gotta, watch, <laughs> you gotta watch that. It's Do great. I? Yeah. It's a great show. It's fucking old. It's old, yeah. But it's yeah. good. Yeah. It's a it's a classic. Yeah. Classic show. So the Black Lodge is done. <laughs> uh what's your, the next what's the next spot you go to the wallflower oh wallflower great spot okay it's by my house perfect they got brunch Ooh, brunch little, little caesar benny oh yeah they got a vegan caesar all right <laughs> <laughs> brunch is great but what do you what do you what's your daily situation out here when you're living or staying in la what do you do do you wake up in the morning get breakfast right away do you not eat breakfast what do you got going what do you on usually stay with yeah here? um i don't really st- stay with anyone usually like me and fabi will get a place to stay somewhere okay because like when i stayed down here for four months i feel like that's the only thing i'm basing it off of because yeah. that's like got you yeah we like stay down here for four months just like wake up get a coffee probably go skate because you can skate every day here <laughs> true, yeah. true true yeah. true it's always good to go is there a park you usually go to or is it just kind of street skate wherever depends on the day like if you're not gonna go street skate definitely hit a park sure yeah is there a park that you like out here like a, f- a favorite one i like the yellow parks the yellow parks the like it's a bunch of them like the one in torrance that one's is that considered a yellow park or like oh harbor uh, city no there's a new oh, one in torrance I or would you say like that opened up recent, el, uh, somewhat el, el serino el serino yeah, yeah, yeah is that a yellow park that's a yellow park yeah, okay for it's sure. concrete and yellow yeah i never thought i've never heard that term before I haven't either. They're popping yeah. up though. But yeah, it's I was trying to let that come together so I could be like, okay, now I know. <laughs> <laughs> I'll let Kelly and Chris figure this one out. <laughs> no, the yellow parks. Yeah, I know. Yeah, they're all yellow. Yeah, it's weird, right? Like, why it's is it yellow? Theme. I saw one. I swear, Tom Penny was skating it. He's in Europe, but it was a yellow park. Mm. And I'm like, damn, they're really putting this internationally. Huh. Well, listen, I mean, the street leagues are like the blue and red, you know? Yeah, true. Type parks. Usually. Yellow is just international now, I guess. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> New shit. <laughs> a pink park. Color transcends. So, but you'd rather go street skating than a sc- uh, skate park? Uh, I don't, not every day. No, okay, okay, <laughs> Some okay. days. Let's get into a uh, big moment in any skateboarder's career, so to speak. Turning pro. Amazing. I mean, for girl skateboards, no less. Like, this is a legacy company. This company's been around, forefront of a lot of videos, incredible skateboarders. You're the first girl to go pro for girl skateboards. It's legendary. This Pretty is, awesome. It's this legendary. definitely been a question for a lot of time. <laughs> Some good innuendos there. <laughs> <laughs> but how did that feel? I mean, that's an amazing feat, you know, for any, any skateboarder. It's so, it was really cool to go pro for girl. Yeah. It was fucking cool. I'm not yeah. going to lie. It was like, that's like the company that did everything right, kind of. You know, sure. like did all the coolest videos. Like, 
everyone's favorite riders mm-hmm. fucking girl you know or that's just how i feel yeah but, yeah no for, for sure for sure you're right you're right did you have any <laughs> yeah, yeah yeah totally did you have an idea <laughs> don't look at me <laughs> i didn't want to leave you hanging <laughs> did you have an idea this was happening or did they surprise you no i knew it was happening uh, oh you did i did how did you know did they tell you yeah the... oh, they did. <laughs> <laughs> Well, listen. This day and age, I mean, so a lot of surprises go a lot happen. You know, a lot of no, things. no, for sure. But it, like, Meg was like, so like, graphics. I was like, oh, okay, here we go. Here we fucking go. Right. <laughs> yes. Yeah, just like that. Just like, so, what are you thinking about, like, graphics wise? Like, that's how she slid it on you. Like, it was. Yeah, she was like, like if you could have a graphic, what would you do? I and that. I was like, oh that's shit. I was like, talk to my friend Charlie. <laughs> Uh, well, obviously we got the, I mean, for the first one, it's always the, uh, the OG. 93 till. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So that's amazing, you know? And then this is, uh, I take it this is what Charlie did? Yes. Okay. I was wondering who did that, you know? It's a, it's great. So you, what, you just sent her the, you sent Meg the, um, this graphic? No, I was like, I like, was oh, like, Meg, like, I don't want to fucking know anything. Just talk to my friend Charlie. <laughs> I don't want to know. Okay. Okay. Because I wanted it to be a surprise. I love that. Oh, you okay? Yeah. Got I was you. like, I don't want to fucking. As much know as you know, on. you wanted to be a surprise. Yeah. Right. So you didn't know what Charlie did. No, I had no idea. But you knew about that one. Did you get to choose the colors or anything for that one for the OG? Yeah, but I, she just asked me what I like, what my favorite colors were. Do you, What's that, do like you, a like a burgundy or something? It's purple. Purple. Oh, it's like yeah. a dark purple. It's a special little purple. It's a special purple. I didn't pick the special purple. little I just said purple. You said purple? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. How is it? She didn't uh, have the Pantone on deck. You didn't have the Pantone <laughs> book. I, I always, I've never met Meg before, but I always like, I think so highly of her, and especially yeah. of the brands that she's built and everything like that. And, and she is so funny. She, she sounds is. hilarious. Oh my God. And th- so do you usually talk with her or do you talk, I mean, like the Sam Smythe's team manager, yeah. Rick Howard, and then Megan. Do you talk to Megan? more often you say i definitely talk to megan the most out of anyone there yeah. mm-hmm. like but that's just i don't know i just like talking to megan you know yeah i think she's so proud though too on some real shit that she's like likes having someone on girl that's a girl you know what i mean that she can have a conversation with and relate with you know what mm-hmm. i mean I, yeah. I, that's just how i'm interpreting yeah her. no we for sure like we're homies. Yeah, so, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. That's sick. She's great. I yeah, mean, you can, I mean, Kelly's right. I mean, coming even, uh, over there at uh, World Industries and mm-hmm. stuff like that. She, he long, long career no of doubt. building brands. It's crazy because you know? no one even fucking knows who she is. I know. She, like, people know, but not like everyone knows. But right. like, yeah, but the, like people that know know. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. she's just so fucking low key. Like she does it because she loves to do it, yep. mm-hmm. and it just doesn't matter if people know. Right. It doesn't. But at she's all. like. But it, it does though, because she's no. Fucking, but I'm saying like, from, from her, from, from her point yeah. of view. No, absolutely. I, I think people should know. We want her to come fucking sit right here. Oh, yeah. dude, <laughs> <laughs> Meg. <laughs> yeah, straight up. Yeah, yeah. But she just put so much personality into like Crail Tap Camp. For like, sure. With like the stuff she would put on the internet, and even like the Crail Ringer. Go mm-hmm. follow that. It's Crail hilarious. Ringer is so good. It's so good. So, good. <laughs> so smart. So witty. Yeah. Because yeah. yeah. every time I see it pop up, I'm like, oh god, what's a caption? You know. Yeah. I just read the caption. So witty and everything. Mm-hmm. But is she from Canada too? Mm-hmm. No, no, just Rick. Because mm-hmm. why does she always do the Canadian like what? Uh, what does she do? Like every day, it's like the Canadian Ringer cra- of the day. Ringer of the day. I'm like, why is it always Canadian? She just loves us. <laughs> <laughs> sure, sure. She's been around Rick long enough. Bro. Yeah. So it's Rick, Rick. Now it's me. Right. <laughs> All these fucking Canadians. Uh, what about Rick Rick, uh, Rick McCrank? Do you see him often up in, in Vancouver? Do you skate with him a lot? I see him around for yeah. sure. Yeah, I'll see him hanging out at the shop sometimes when I go by. Okay. Reading a little book on the stoop. Talking yeah? to Michelle. Um, I don't skate with him like a ton. He's always doing some random. Sh- he's like super into surfing right now. I think. Really? Yeah. There's a lot of people got that bug right mm-hmm. now. Yeah. He's on the surfing bug. He's going over to Tofino to surf and stuff. And, wow. You know, he he does other shit besides skate, so he's like doing other stuff. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's great though, McCrank. Oh, he's a legend. Dude. Oh man, I remember when he got on Girl. I was like, whoa, dude. This really? Was, yeah. I mean, it's kind of like left field almost, it but it it just made it made sense as well. Wait, Definitely why not. was it left field? Not th- because we didn't. Ex- I didn't expect it. I didn't know because look, I think that Rick has his relationships with people in 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 Canada, and 
maybe those were a closer relationship that me, the people that were on the team might not have known of. So that's how I, I was surprised by it. But at the end of the day, I knew there was a reason that he was there. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. It was for all the right causes, for the but right reasons. And he, but, I, as watching as a kid, I could have sworn he was on Platinum. Maybe not. But he went from Platinum to Plan B, then Plan B to Birdhouse. And then right when he got on Birdhouse, the end came out. And it was like, holy shit, Rick McCrank. And mm-hmm. then he just got on Girl right, right. after. You right, got right. cherry bombs. Huh? Cher- cherry bombs. Oh, shit. But it was uh, also like Colin McKay. It was almost like left field, you know? It was like, wow, Colin McKay's on Girl. That's so sick, you know? Yeah. But it's yeah. just these left field type things. Plus, I think Girl and Chocolate, they're kind of known for bringing up like new talent, right? They don't really steal people from different companies and stuff. It's Everybody's got their own thing. They respect all the companies so much that they're not going to like just grab somebody, you know? So if, when McCrane comes along, you're like... You just birdhouse. What? Well, this is strange. Uh, Colin McKay, you mm-hmm. know, stuff like that. Yeah, Colin McKay like, was short lived, though, too. That's yeah. true. Like, That's true. Maybe. Was that just like Chocolate Tour? He was in that. He was in that video. Yeah. And then Brian Anderson moved over to Girl. Mm hmm. There were, and people were moving over. Mark Johnson went to Chocolate. That's true. It was like they didn't steal people, but they attracted them. Girl and chocolate attracts. Well, they a lot. they had to quit first. You totally. know what I mean? Like it was one of those things. Where no, it's like, not listen, like if you're not riding for anybody, then call us. No, right? yeah, like I'm saying. I mean, they weren't like, hey, come ride for us. They were just like, people wanted to ride for girl and chocolate. And they still do. Yeah, but that's what they always have done. Right. If you're on whatever company, you're just like, man, girl and chocolate. That's the shit. I wish mm-hmm. you can get on that. Hell yeah. Just saying. Now you're on. Yeah. Yeah. How's it feeling? (laughs) Not even on. Pro. It's incredible. Did anything, did did it put more pressure on you or were you just stoked to turn pro? Because sometimes that pro status, you know what I mean? Did you skate your own boards? Answer that first. (laughs) (laughs) Answer that first. I'm skating my own board. Okay. okay. (laughs) Because it is a a little weird at first, right? But then you're like, ah. Yeah. Okay, but the black dip one's chill because it just says gearing and like scratchy writing. So okay. that oh, one's cool. Yeah, I was just right. like, yeah. I was getting that one. Gotcha. And my friend made it. So it's so like dope, you know? Yeah, it's Perfect. meaningful for sure. Yeah. Perfect. What? You skate your own board, right? I do. I do. Do you? I do. Yeah. Definitely. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, then. I think a long time ago, I'm going to just go back 25 years Please. and that's fucking whatever. That's kind of some some time that's older than people, her <laughs> people they dudes didn't really do that you know what i mean right. they, yeah. they, they would skate their homies board rather than skate their board you know what i mean mm-hmm. so um but we've come a long way and 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 we're all about self-promotion these days so yeah. you know yeah, yeah. and I, I i still like riding the homies boards but it's sometimes but they now they make the boards in the shape that you because also we're trying to you know promote that board as well you know so yeah. but it is a little weird for the best thing is seeing your board out in the wild and somebody else is riding it, you're like, that motherfucker that's that a good guy that's has crazy. my board. And then you wonder, like, like holy this shit. shit. But you're like, does this person know who I am, though? Yeah, that's true, <laughs> They don't, yeah, that's They true. don't. Some, <laughs> in some cases, yeah, that is true. But yeah. you know what? That shop seriously pushed them in the right direction and yeah. then they got that board. So For sure. Yeah, super cool. There you go, yeah. How but, many how many crab boards you seen this year? Oh, <laughs> I can't even count. I can't even count how many. Oh, I get tagged. I get tagged on Instagram a lot. You know, my the, my twin tail board that just came out. The twin. Uh, I shouldn't say twin tail because it's a hybrid of a twin of a a twin and a tail. A, a <laughs> nose and a tail. Twin paddle. Twin paddle. Thank there you, Raj. Uh, a lot of people love that board. But they, you, board. you see people tagging you, but, oh you, don't, God. but you don't respond to any of them. No, no. it's too fucking cool for that <laughs> shit. What do you mean? It's, uh, no, listen, it's not that I'm too cool. It's just I'm, listen, I don't do the Instagram thing well. I really don't. I, it's, it's a lot for me. The DMs are too much for me. Um, oh, the DMs are crazy. Yeah, fuck that shit. Do you get a lot of DMs? I think anyone on Instagram that... Yeah, no, yeah. I think we all on. get a lot of fucking DMs. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It's just a lot. It's a lot, you know, and my fear, and this is just my fear, is that it's it's going to turn into a whole conversation that I don't. <laughs> yeah, because really once have. you open that shit, it's open. But, yeah, no but like, what's the worst? What's the most fucked DM you've ever gotten? Oh, I they're all beautiful. Man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Really? Yeah, I haven't. No, no, no. It's just pure love. Uh, nothing. Once in a blue, once in a blue. Yeah, they they do. People are dumb. Yeah, we get some stupid ones. (laughs) Yeah. Yeah. Why you you just just ignore them? You know. Wait, you're constantly getting some fucking fucked up shit. 
No, it's that well, that question was not about me. I asked that fucking question. <laughs> <laughs> I've probably gotten like one where I had to be like, damn, okay, and hit him back, and then I'll leave it at that. I don't. Try, I'm not trying to do the back and forth. You know mm. what I mean? But it was enough for like to to pull me out of like, okay, right. And then I said something, and I left it, and that that deleted him, and that was it. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. We're in a different position though, as well, because we have this show now too. So we're not just skateboarders. We're actually in people's living yeah, rooms famous. every day well listen <laughs> <laughs> no and i've never that, been but... like do you gotta watch what you say sometimes and yeah. i never really like knew that to a certain degree yeah and don't get me wrong i'm fucking definitely smart about what the fuck i'm saying but same time like you can be in the moment and we're having drinks and we're just in the moment you can say some shit and yeah. it, it can backfire right <laughs> yeah no you have to be like careful yeah yeah not that you shouldn't always be but when it's like someone could watch it over again 10 times on the inter- internet and pick it apart yeah that's when it's like it, i yeah. mean people take things out of context they do this they do that you can you may not even say anything and you know that you that that pertains to anything that they they interpret yeah like it's all about how they interpret it totally. you know so it's an interesting thing but uh yeah i don't know you just keep it moving just keep it moving. Yeah, can't really feed back into that shit. Yeah. Just kind of move forward straight ahead. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. How's your Instagram looking? Do you get a lot of crazy shit or no? It's now it's your good turn. These now days. it's your turn. Good. Good. <laughs> the last thing I posted was uh, a nice meal I made. I, I was looking at your Instagram today, and I was just like, Ooh. "You're like, what am I gonna ask her?" <laughs> no, no. I was just looking. I was. I don't know why. I was just like, "Oh yeah, she's coming on. I want to see what she's been up to lately." Mm-hmm. And then I was just like, "Oh yeah, she's." Some food. Nice. Yeah, I've been really into posting my veggie dogs on my story. Okay. Veggie dogs. Do you make them from scratch? Nope. Oh. <laughs> I just throw some chili and some cheese on there. Mm. Love it. Chili cheese yeah. dogs? Usually I don't have a burger bun, so I just put it in some well, normal bread. Yeah, it's yep, pretty yep. appetizing looking. Okay. Yeah, it'll work. Mustard, ketchup? No. What do you do? Stay well, with. not when there's chili and cheese. I don't know, though. Is that a thing? I don't know. Ch- I put. Is it what? mustard good with Hell that? Hell yeah. yeah. No, not, maybe not ketchup. I do mustard on chili. Mustard on yeah. chili. Mustard yeah. you could run. Yeah, sure. you could run that. Definitely. For sure. I fuck with mustard. Yeah. Mustard's good. yeah. It's a little more tasteful. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a big fan of honey mustard. I'm a fan of both. Dijon? No. No? <laughs> no. 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 Dijon. Budget. You know, why, why? It's just got a different taste that I'm not, it's not acquiring to me. You just don't fuck with Dijon. I don't. If it, look, if I, if it was a dry ass sandwich and all <laughs> I had was Dijon, I'll put it on there. How about that? What so about you, you want to eat a dry sandwich? I won't eat a dry sandwich. And you yeah, dry eat. sandwich? I mean, I will <laughs> if I'm fucking hungry. I'll eat that shit. But <laughs> I would like <clears throat> I would like a, a, a condiment on there. <laughs> <laughs> I think you could make that happen. Right, most times. Yeah. I, and you're, when you're in Europe, though, sometimes you it's you know tough. they yeah. got them dry ass sandwiches, and you're like, dude. Well, they just give you like one ketchup packet. <laughs> yeah. Like, Here's your yeah, condiment. Can I like, get another I one? need like a handful. <laughs> yeah. I, I, like, don't nah. run, I don't run one condiment. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but you know. She's like, the, what the fuck are you yeah, talking you about? No, no, about no, 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 no. This is what we I, usually do. <laughs> just fuck nonsense. with the condiments. It's all good. <laughs> condiments are great. <laughs> What's your favorite? What, kind, what do you fuck <laughs> with? You get, uh, mustard, ketchup? Mayo. 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 Okay. I fucking love mayo, See, dude. I'm a mayo I, fan. I'm a, the biggest fan, and I fucking yeah. hate that I'm the biggest fan. Oh my god, yeah. You're like going I to a fucking. For that shit. You're trying to go get food somewhere, and you're like, hey, can I get a, a couple like extra mayos? So they're like, yeah, I got you. And you're like halfway through your stuff, and you're like, listen, can I please have a couple more I need extra more mayo. mayos? <laughs> I'm taking those home for sure. Are you eating like? Are you like? Would you dip a chip in mayo and eat it? Yeah. That sounds Ooh. gross, dude. I'm not. I don't. I don't. I'm not a huge fan of, of mayo. I can't hate on that, but it's definitely go. <laughs> go. I can't uh, hate on that. Sandwich thing. though, mayo, mustard, I, all that stuff. Yeah. A chip, it. like a chip, chip, or like a French fry. Uh whatever you want to do, don't matter. What were you talking about though? I don't know. She's I like, think he was talking about like a chip, like, like, a, actual like chip. a potato oh, chip. Oh fuck no 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 no. That's yeah. cool. oh. she's talking about fry. Okay, you're talking I about fry. I thought you were like trying to like relate to me on some fucking chips and I don't know. Fish and chips shit. I don't know. <laughs> uh, when I do fuck with mayonnaise with a fry is when it's mixed with ketchup. Mm, I okay. Mix it and it turns into like a little thousand. Because something about it seems less like thick and yeah. eggy. <laughs> yeah. You just add like a tint of ketchup and you're like, okay, you're I can do this then now. We're good. That's what then Thousand that's Island is, right? Yeah. 
See, I fuck with Thousand Island. <laughs> See, so yeah. you fuck with it. <laughs> <laughs> I just don't like it that that white. You, know? <laughs> <laughs> you gotta add some color. To yeah, you, you gotta add some color. color to that shit, dude. It makes it more appealing. You gotta mix the paint. You know? Do they have a thing with <laughs> mustard and mayonnaise? A little mustard. Yeah, it's called honey mustard, Kelly. Is that what that is? Yeah. Man, well. No. No, no, it's, it's not. It's close, though. It's See, you looked at me like I was nuts for She's not close. knowing that. Okay, there's honey in it, too. Yeah, they threw some sweetness in there. Yeah. All right. See? Sweet chili sauce. Ooh, that's my favorite. Ranch? Oh, fuck. ranch I fuck with all the sauces. All, all the, sauces. the sauces. All the sauces. I fuck with ranch, too. Well, I, I can't say all the sauces. You like relish? I do. Relish is good. I put relish in my tuna. <laughs> Well, you have to. That's a prerequisite to. <laughs> she tuna, don't like right? tuna, but I put good That's in my tuna. fucking filthy. <laughs> Tuna's filthy. Yeah, I do it. You don't like tuna? Oh well, my she's God, vegan. No. Yeah, oh, but, that's right. <laughs> but like, take it away. You know, I like meat. I like the taste of meat, but sure. tuna is fucking pure filth. You don't like that? Mushed up fish. Oh, like is in it the can? Is yeah. it the texture the or just the smell? It was all everything, all of the above. That's cat food. Okay. <laughs> See, that's why I <laughs> think cat loves it. Actually. I don't like I don't like mayonnaise is because it reminded me of cat food, the tuna packets or the tuna things, and it came with the mayonnaise. Mm -hmm. And I was like, "Oh, that's gross." Well, that's how you make yeah, the you tuna. Exactly. That's why I didn't I didn't like She's the tuna really? smelling. <laughs> I didn't like the mayonnaise. I love it. Yeah. Cool. That's that's my reasoning. Mm -hmm. And I stick to it. Stick no, it's fair it. as fuck. No, okay. no, no. <laughs> <laughs> it's gross. <laughs> it's, it's gross. Yeah, yeah thank it's you. gross. Thank you. Yeah. Yes. So what's going on now? Like <laughs> bands. I mean, congratulations to all these epic fucking sponsors. It's incredible. <laughs> For real, <laughs> for real. No, it's impressive. Thanks, man. I love it. <laughs> so you got the vans, you got the uh, girl skateboards, uh, trucks. Independent. Independent. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. Wheels. Spitty. Got the nice best sponsors. I'm telling you, this list is great. <laughs> What's your board setup right now? What size and everything? You want to know the specs? Specs. <laughs> Spec it out. Let's break it down. I got a G O forty five girl deck. It's fucking mine. <laughs> oh, that's your shape. Yeah. Okay. What's yeah, but it's also my board. What size? Eight. Oh, just straight, straight up eight. Yeah. Okay. Is there like a okay. short wheelbase on it or what? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Yeah. Nice. Mm. Fuck with that. Yeah, yeah, I do too. Short wheelbases are the way to go. I I agree. I always trip because for a long time that eight inches bo eight inch boards most of them if it got to eight and up. They had a big ass wheelbase. Yeah. And I could not, it was so hard for me to get used to. That's why I never rode eights. That happened to me. Yeah. Uh, Brian Anderson board. I switched in for some reason. That wheelbase was just fucking gigantic. He's and a it, tall man. it threw me off Definitely like no is. other. It scared me to death. And never they never, yeah, they never made eight inches that were not big wheelbase. They didn't do that for the longest time. Yeah. So that's cool that you got to design your own little shape. Yeah, it's good. Yeah works for these little shoulders you know what i'm saying <laughs> <laughs> what about what size wheels 50 uh, 53 53 oh, i was gonna say 52 okay yeah same shit. <laughs> it's like the same thing i know but you know what it's so funny though i trip on millimeters because one millimeter makes such a big difference it does and it's the smallest does. little measurement too it's was, like that small. especially when you skate you flat ground so? yeah it does i think Timing. two feels weird okay twos i think did. ones like doesn't matter so you could skate 51s i mean i'm sorry 52s yeah. Right. Okay. So but I then can, it just doesn't go as far, maybe. You I know? see. It makes mm. a difference. Yeah, oh, but it's yeah. fucking switch them out. <laughs> <laughs> she got the options. We can yeah, keep yeah. switch those out. I remember skating. I would skate 50 or 51, but once I hit a 52, it was like the timing was all off on flat ground tricks. It's weird yeah. because when you ride, assessment. yeah, when yeah. you ride a 51, you they get down to 50s, you know, after yeah. a while. So. I just thought, I thought 50, 51 was, it, that's the range that I skate in, you know? Yeah, yeah. 50, and 52, so, fuck, I, I, doing a fakie flip, tail just misses completely. Uh, really? Yeah. Well, I mean, I'll have to get used to it. I just yeah, don't want to get, I don't want to get used to new shit, you know? You want to get used, to, or you want to skate stuff you, yeah. you like to skate. To Once yeah. I find yeah. something, I, just, I roll with it. I do not switch anything out. I'm in the adjustment period right now. Those new Royals came in and like, mm. I'm like, okay, dude, this is definitely, it's not the same. So you got to get used to it. I'm trying to get used to it. Okay. And it's adjustment. Is yeah. that what you were skating the other day? Uh, No. Oh. I didn't. No. I just hooked them up yesterday. Yeah. You rocked the stock bushings? I did. I tried to get the, you know, I, the bones bushings and they were fresh out at Val Surf. So. Oh, I, run, yeah, I run stock Fuck. bushings. Yeah. You ride stock bushings on the Indies? Oh, I ride the stock bushings. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I take out the bottom the little, washer though. Little plate. Mm. Yeah. 
but I think I'm going to stop doing that. Oh, you take out the bottom but leave the top. Yeah. Plate. Why oh, do you okay. do that? Cuz it makes them like wiggle. Wiggle more. Clear. But oh, in a good way, you know, like you get <laughs> <laughs> You can like tighten them enough, like a lot, but then there's still like a good amount of like It gives like a little. Like they turn bit. quick. But I think I'm going to try to make it less turny cuz I feel like you can pop higher if it's not as wiggly. You there know what you I'm go. saying? I feel that. Yeah. I feel like it's a little bit tighter, has a better uh Yeah. I don't know, better snap to it, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, because you're not like. It doesn't give when you pop like when you. Oh, I like just getting a little bit of tighter trucks. So when if it gives a little bit, you lose the pop. I feel like. Yeah, that's on, how you fakey trade switch man. <laughs> Wait, so you're saying you're gonna <laughs> switch? You're gonna go tighter trucks? You ride loose trucks I right now? I want to go a little tighter. Okay. Yeah. Wait, what's? Do you skate the mids or do you skate the? No, the... dude. Fuck mids. Oh. <laughs> Damn, like the, okay. Just like the... No, I think mid... I don't know. Who fucking cares? I don't care. <laughs> it's all preface, but she ain't fuck with the mid. No, I don't. <laughs> Have you tried them? I don't need to. There you go. <laughs> Perfect. Hey, all right. So you skate the indie, just, just the, the regular indies. Yeah. Standard issue. What do you skate? I skate uh, Thunders. Thunders. Yeah. But they, like, they used to call them highs, but now they're just all just regular Thunders. So there's not a high or a low. Oh, wow. All truck market, fuck. <sighs> it's just one side. Or just one height. You know? I don't understand it. 149s, 148s, 148s. It's, everybody's got a different measurement, you know? Yeah. Well, weird. dude, back in, weird. The, back in the day, remember, we, everyone skated Ventures, and there were all oh, yeah. 5.0 Ventures, and they were like the smallest little boards. See? Mm -hmm. And now it's a little different. Now a little bigger. I just wish they would all kind of... Agree on something. Agree on something. Or have the same like measurements, right? Uh, I think even Crux, I'm sorry to interrupt. I think Crux actually calls them what the board size is, I think. Yep. Yep. See? They Alex, got it together. Alex they know White. what to do. Alex Weiss. Shout out Alex Weiss. Shout yeah. out. There you go. Yeah. She's the best. You need some grip tape? I can get you some mob if you want it. Do you want to give me some of that shit? Yeah. <laughs> yes. What do I got to do? Just give me your address. <laughs> 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 I already get my bitch. <laughs> do I send you grip? I don't send you grip. I don't grip. think you send me grip. <laughs> <laughs> Who does Gavin send you grip? Yeah, I think so. Okay, you can hit me up too. Should I hit you up? Yeah, I'm the team manager. I didn't know that. <laughs> well, there's Sounds so like many... she already has an in over there. Yeah. yeah. No, I mean, I was totally just being a prick, but like, yes, please. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. I like it. Yeah. Oh, I, love I didn't know you were the, the mop person. Yeah, you know, well, so there's been, I mean, I that's it was a big. Cairo. Cairo is the brand manager. Oh. Yeah. So there's a lot of people that, like, you know, Gavin was there, been there for a long time, and whatever. People come and go. But, like, you could hit up any, you could hit up Rhino, and mm -hmm. Rhino would be like, oh, yeah, here, I got you on grip. And then he would hit me up, and I'd be like, yeah, sure, oh, I'll send right. some grip See, out. See, that's right. the thing I think I've always done is just hit up somebody for something. Yeah, hit up anyone at, at NHS. Like, yo, can I get some grip? And they like, sure. And they forward it to me or they forward it to Cairo, and it gets sent out. No, so. that's cool. Sorry. No, you're, you're, it's all good. <laughs> Kelly's got seven jobs over here, so I yeah. Know. She looks like kind of scared right now for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, what? I don't know. Uh, I'll say, I got a little too loud. <laughs> I love it. I love it. So listen, what what do you got? Are you you working on anything at the moment? You working on any projects? What's going What's going on over there? No. No. Not really. Nothing. nothing just, no just video. Just trying to skate and okay. film, but not for anything in particular. Got you. Okay. A couple clips you, in the chocolate video. Hopefully. Hey. Where's yours? Trying. Ooh. I like that. that you're coming at me. <laughs> Shit. Um, I, I would be very happy if I can get should a we clip. Go, should we go skate this week? Let's go. Let's go. I'm down. Okay. Where are you guys going to go skate at? Uh, somewhere that I can get a clip. Hopefully me too. <laughs> <laughs> but who do you guys hit up for to go skate? Like, oh, Policelli. You get a Policelli. Yeah. No, he, I just talked to him about it. He oh, said he was did? down. There he said go. he'd take us out. He Let's said he go. was down to film me, though. Where's your crobs? He said my crobs? Yeah, your crobs. Uh, I, got a, I got a clip with him the other day. Policelli. Really? Hell yeah. No Would way. You? That's Where? right. I had the curbs, a little slappy. Did you? Mm. Yeah, I'm on the slappy Timeless. shit. Timeless. Yes. For the chocolate video? I have no idea whatever they want to do with it. Damn. You know, but I heard from the higher ups, they said, man, can you, from Policelli, can you get more of those clips of hey. C-Rob? I said, well, let me see what I can do. There Does Megan hit you guys up? No. Yeah. Oh, she probably yeah. Yes. <laughs> oh no, she does. Hit, she does hit me up from time to time though. Oh yeah. 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 I love Meg. But uh, let's go. Can we go? Do you have you ever been skating down at the beach? The uh, yeah. the slappy. Do you like the slappies? 
Yeah, I can get down. Okay, with it. we get down. With she it. doesn't like it. It's, so <laughs> it's so fun. It's so fun. So fun. Nah, nah, I do. I don't. Like them. <laughs> but I will. It's fun. It, it does. You know. They're it's, fun. It's, like it's, it's skateboarding. It's skateboarding. But... Exactly. Exactly. We could. We could hit. Yeah, we should. Let's do it. So you wait, she, so you just film it. Go, wait, go I was ahead. just like she's probably like more into like the little mayo pad. There's one a little mayo pad down the street that's from true. there. It's pretty fun. I skate a lot. Really? Yeah. It's an OG like drawn skated back in oh, like the one that's like this tall. Yeah. 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 Oh, we like that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that's, that's fun. fun. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so if you were going out skating one day and you had to choose like an obstacle to go skate, that's your preference. What would it be? Would a manual pad, a ledge, a bump? Like I don't a, like that. I really don't like that. You don't like I what? like going to a spot with people uh-huh. and trying to skate it. I don't like picking like I want to skate a ledge today. Okay. Got you. You know what I mean? Yep. So you're very spontaneous versus I, Yeah, it has like, to be spontaneous. Strategic. Like I need to go do this kickflip over this fucking bar today. Like Only if you've tried it before. Right. Because you got there somehow. But right. like <laughs> Yeah, it has to be spontaneous. There's no way. I like that though. though. I like that. Yeah. Let me ask you a question since we're on the skate trick stuff. You had the cl- you had a clip on that uh, Pasadena. <laughs> that, <laughs> Just that bring bump that up. <laughs> to, it's the hideous bump. The it's worst. it's. The, what did you do on it? The hip, inward she, heel. The hip. Uh, did, impossible. Did, you did impossible. Oh, that fucking bump. Okay. <laughs> I, I want to because that thing sucks. Dude, Who's the run-up, the run-up. Oh, wait, wait, wait. my God. Who brought you there? I'm, I'm pretty sure you didn't want to go skate it. Did you just like no. drive by it? What was the story behind that? That was my choice. <laughs> that was, okay, you didn't I know ne- what you were getting yourself into, did you? <laughs> I would have never guessed. Nope. I, well, no, because I knew. I was like, this looks so chill to skate. I know it's fucking not chill to skate. Right. But I was looking on the... There's, there's like a Skate Spots app thing on the internet. If you look up skate spots in LA, there's a fucking skate spots thing. Okay. Yeah, for yep. sure. Okay. And that was on it. And I was like, I want to go there. Like now. Like now. <laughs> 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 and we went and checked it out. And I was like, okay. So if you do something on this, it counts. <laughs> <laughs> right. I mean, yeah, like it's a, it's a spot. It's a yeah. spot. For sure. But. The first time I went there, I tried impossible tail grab. And you know how the, I don't know if you guys have skated it, but the run up is so fucking annoying because you have to run as hard as you can and then you're not going fast enough. And then there's all, a bunch of cracks in the way. So I couldn't, I just couldn't pop high enough to do the tail grab. I tried it. I was like, I'm over it. I went home. And mm. then I was like, someone was like, impossible. Just do that. And I was like, okay, yeah, I'm just going to do that. And I went back a second time and I didn't do it. Oh, no. And I think that was the time I smoked myself. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. Yeah, I was so I was so mad. The sun was setting. It was like slightly too dark for the camera. Uh, oh, that's the worst. And I just when you're trying to battle yeah. the sunlight. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And I just got so now. fucking mad. I smacked it on the metal and I pulled an Ed Templeton and smacked myself in the face with it. Add insult to injury. It was yeah. like it was like a borderline laugh. Like punch myself in the face again. Sure, then, though, you know I was just yeah. like, so stupid. God, did you realize that and was gonna be like what you just like? That was pretty damn funny. It was or, so funny, okay. but I had to like go around the corner and be really mad for a minute. Yeah, first. I was gonna say right. it's one of those things you get so mad about. You're like, damn, I knew that was funny, but I'm so pissed off yeah, right now. Yeah, I was <laughs> like that. I was like, <laughs> there was you know, that sitting on the sidewalk. <laughs> there was that video, and I don't know who it was. I thought about when I saw you do that. Some dude's getting like a bank, and he like falls and then throws his board but then slips and i think he hits his head on the side I don't do you know. remember that i think we watched after him. after he threw his board, yeah he yeah slipped and fell yeah he slipped, I it hit his, but it was like all these things that happen and you're like it must it is like the worst thing but when you look back at it it's the funniest thing of all time oh yeah you gotta laugh at yourself though yeah, yeah. it just takes a second you know so you went back <laughs> four off. times is that right three three times yeah Listen, it's a great spot. It looks great on film. Yeah. It's a cool spot to get it's a clip on, but it sucks to skate. You know, that's why I thought I was like, oh, somebody must have brought her here or something. Like she I, asked for it. I know. I didn't even <laughs> think that you actually <laughs> picked the spot. I mean, yeah. it does look kind of cool. sick it's when good, you look cool at it. It's a cool spot to look at. Yeah. But if you it's know cool it, you're like, dude, done. I'm not going there. So I mean, fresh. especially as a person that's from LA, I'm sure, or from the general area, sure. you're like, no, no, no. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 
Oh, yeah. Well, it used to be like the concrete was way better back in the day, right? I mean, that spot I mean, has been around. When I skated for... that thing. That thing was fucking rugged. Oh, it was Already still then, back so, then? Yeah, for sure. I know it's even way. I don't gnarly. think they repaid unless, that. Unless thing. they like bondoed it, or did they? Did they do that? Did There's it seem like, like a it? sheet of bondo on the the bank to go down, but then it's like. I think Roger might have done yeah. that. Roger, was he here? Yeah, me and uh, Chico did a That's right. bunch of bondo over there. Who there did? Who who hit it? Chico. Chico. Chico For Brennan. the chocolate video? Oh, he was trying to manual. Dude. Yeah, oh. it was like pretty sweet. Yeah. What was it, Nolly Hill oh. manual down there? I think so, yeah. Wait, Nolly Hill manual? He tried to Nolly Hill over the hip and then manual down. Oh, shit. Did you see Crazy Frankie's trick? What did he do? Is he the where he kick flipped off of it? Back 360 flip, kick flip off then. Yeah, that yeah. was fucked up. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Wait a minute. Wait, you, had, you dropped down on, did he go over the sidewalk or did it was he land like, on the sidewalk? He like landed right at the end and then the. Oh, uh, okay. Gotcha. You know? Damn. Gotcha. Yeah, I was That's tripping. Gnarly. Kick flipped off of That's that thing. Super gnarly. Shitty, shitty ass ground. Dude, really? yeah. that was fucked. Ooh. Yeah. Hey, I want to see that now. Crazy Frankie. Yeah. Isn't that one spot right on the other side of it where you, maybe I'm totally tripping, where you go, you drop in? And go off a ledge over the sidewalk. I don't know if you guys know. There is a spot like that right across the street. Like right there, right? I don't know right? if it's the one, but. Is that Glendale? Pasadena, Glendale. I thought yeah. the pump was that in area. Pasadena. It's like literally next to Garbanzo. I don't think I've been to that park. You haven't been to Garbanzo? Really? Oh. I don't think so. Is that the wooden one? That's Pasadena. Garbanzo's like. Grant did that crazy transfer into the bowl. Mm-hmm. Jerry Sue always skates. In oh the bank yeah, 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 yeah. I I never have been there. No, nope. it's, it's got really a good fine. It has a really good hip. Yeah, it's got Perfect. a good pyramid there and everything. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. So what's going on? You're down here in L.A. What did you did you come down here for any specific reason or are you just to get out of? I just wanted to get out of the rain. Vancouver. It's um, a bit. Has it been raining up there a lot? Yeah, it's pissing. Fuck. That's uh, no indoor parks either, huh? Mm-hmm. Dude, there's no indoor park. Why is that? It's I don't fucking know. That is so insanely there's bizarre. Like, yeah. yeah. There's nobody that has. There's one indoor park in Swanson, which is the terminal, the ferry terminal to go to Victoria. Okay. Which is 40 minutes outside of the city. And that, and they closed it because of COVID. And they every time you call them, they're like, we're not opening it. It's COVID. So, like, it might just be done forever. Oh, wow. And yeah. it was, like, really expensive to skate anyway mm. so oh, it's you, like okay. we don't have anything yeah. wow yeah it's fucking stupid i mean the weather out there you need a indoor park what about the plaza do you skate there a bunch yeah but the fucking bridge doesn't do anything it's just always wet mm. oh yeah i mean when it's not raining is that like a oh sp- yeah that's yeah. the spot yeah it's and what was the other spot you called the, the with the manual pad in the middle t fox t fox yeah. that spot looks amazing yeah, you would love that spot. Was, I think you would all love that spot, actually. Looks cool. Is yeah. it kind of a hang... Like, everyone goes there to kind of... It's a plaza vibe, right? You can go there and hang out. Wait yeah, a minute. It's, it's so got chill. the little hip there. It's got the... Nope. I no. skated a park in, in Vancouver when we went up there. It was kind of under the bridge. That's plaza. That's plaza. That's yeah. Okay. Uh, the This spot we're talking about is like an actual, like, in the street spot. Got you. It's yeah, of, it's like downtown. It's Ooh. got like some barriers there and like yeah. a set of stairs. It's like a curb mani pad on marble, and then you could like do tricks up it and skate a seven stair at the end. Mm. But Spencer like, Hamilton skates it a lot. Uh, the Carol Nose Manual. No. no, that's that's on Fairfax. I thought there was one in uh, Canada like that. Do you know who Russ Milligan is? Yeah, he's amazing. Yeah, yeah, a lot Does of pop. Does he have a skate shop? I don't. Know, it's a good question. Does he? I don't, I don't know. I I haven't heard from him in a while, but his his footage is always really impressive. A lot of Canadians, man, fucking good. Really. What about the park that McCrank always skates? The big oh, whoop de woos is... and that's Sealand, right? C uh, sounds or familiar. Or something with a G. That seemed like it would be a bike park for some reason. Right. They, like Penny skated there. Like is that where Muska did the crooked grind down the rail with the with the fucking thing? He was in the. I don't know. With the. Beatbox or whatever. Uh, Boombox. Boombox. Sorry, I don't even know the fuck. Anyway. Listen. (laughs) So nothing going on. You're just out here filming, kicking it, doing your thing. I love that. Yeah. Yeah. Getting footage. I hope I do something. (laughs) Yeah, but I mean, you're just like. You're here. Is that something? Uh, Ah, this counts. Yeah, Yeah. I can expense this fucking trip now. (laughs) (laughs) Glad we could help. Glad we could help. Thanks, guys. Cheers. So, but but what I'm saying is you're just kind of filming, stacking clips, doing your thing. And then maybe, you know, probably something will come along you have footage for. I hope so, yeah. Perfect. Perfect. Vans isn't doing anything. It seems like they're always working on something. I think 
I don't know. Maybe they are, but not with me. Okay. okay. <laughs> they have a lot I mean, of they got a lot of riders. And you yeah. just had a part. I yeah. just did a thing. So yeah. It's totally. not my turn. Yeah. Ah, uh, which is great. That was a good video. It that was. was. Nick Michaels. Nick Michaels. Okay. Is that the yeah. opening? Is that the opening, dude? Yeah. Yeah, he's sick. Great stuff. Yeah. Great stuff. He finds he finds his own spots in L.A. It's yeah, that's cool. what I was tripping on, dude. Yeah. I'm like, how is he skating in L.A. with nothing? I've like, never, never seen anyone hit. hitting this stuff. There that's are dope. those skaters. Tom uh, t- Karingalov. Yeah. Yeah. You know? Oh, my God, yeah. Tom K is so fucking sick. He is. He always has new spots. Ama- and he'll speak, skate a spot that you probably look at every day and you wouldn't even think to skate. Right. Yeah, you see, he's fucking ripping it. He's a genius. He is. Mm-hmm. Seriously. You know he watches movies to find squ- skate spots? Yes. He does. <laughs> yeah. he does. Yeah. How the That's the best when you like, or you like <laughs> have a show. This is crazy. One. That like yeah. in the opening every time there's like a perfect six stair in the background. Right. Oh You're yeah. Like, you see a movie or something. Yeah. Yeah. You see the spot in uh, the Supreme Court in in New York a lot. You know oh, the, really? the ledge that drops down yeah, 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 and yeah. you go off. I would see that in like Law, Law and Order, Order and, and shit like that. For sure. For sure. All right. Well, listen, this has been fabulous. Yes. Yeah, wow. Great. Anything else that you want to like promote or anything going on? What's going on? Shoes coming a, out or anything? Shoes. Collection. What is nothing? I don't Come wanna. on. You don't, you don't want to say? Okay. I don't have anything mm-hmm. to say. Nothing in the works, maybe? <laughs> nothing you could talk about? Okay. Thanks for having me, boys. <laughs> <laughs> Well, listen, this isn't done yet, okay? We would love... I know you travel. I mean, listen, you're getting on a plane and stuff, so maybe we can't... But can we give you a couple nine club things to take take back with you? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, give me some nine club shit. <laughs> okay. Well, I just know mugs are fragile, you know. Oh, you know, I'll, take a, I'll take a mug. You take a mug? Yeah. Okay. Kelly, would you do yeah. the honors, please? We have a couple nine club Here's, things. What about a, what about a candle? You take a candle. Candle. Did you pull belt. A candle? Oh, I'll take a No, I didn't pull candle. anything, yes. actually. Do you use no. a uh, size small? Yeah. Okay. You can come back again and again and again. We'd love to have you. Yeah. Back again, for sure. Yeah, I got to add some years, maybe. Some, some stories. <laughs> you, you'll get them. You'll get them. Trust me. Trust sometimes me. Sometimes it's so it's crazy. Like, when you're in the moment, you're just like, sometimes you go blank on certain things. And you're like, you know it's there. It's there. Mm-hmm. But sometimes it's not there. Yeah. <laughs> Look at all this stuff. Can I you? couldn't find any. Wow. We'll find the sizes after. <laughs> oh, these are... Oh, they're largest. Listen, first, Brian. First of all, pleasure. pleasure so much fun. <laughs> so much fun. Continued. Oh, yeah. pleasure. I'm so stoked that Dude, this is I'm the so first time to meet you. I know. You. Yeah. Really? Definitely. Hey, and continued success. <laughs> She just gave, that's that's she a just, handshake. Yeah, yeah, yep, yep. She just flicked. Oh, we, we go way back. <laughs> oh, way back. Uh, way back. Listen, <laughs> here's some stuff. Okay, first of all, mug. Oh, wait. Do you do this at the end of all the nine? Yeah, we, yeah. We gotta so we gotta plug our product. Mm. You know what I'm oh, saying? <laughs> first of all nine club stickers we do give photo incentive here so next thrasher cover you have get this on the bottom of your board 20 bucks oh, give me that shit. 20 bucks coming to you you know what i'm saying here's a mug wait a minute you got coffee you do coffee oh yeah okay coffee. that's first thing she does in the morning coffee. she said right yes, that's right that's does. right that's right i love coffee uh candle my favorite drink is the uh lacroix pample mousse so we made a uh lacrobe Pample mousse. Lacrobe? Yes. That wow, is, uh, that's special. Grapefruit scented. Love Oh my, that. I can smell it already. Can you smell it? Yeah, it's good. I can smell yeah. it. Take a good whiff of that. <laughs> oh, it's strong. Ooh. That's good. That is good. That'll get any place you're staying in nice and smelly. I tell you what, you know it's good. When in you the best want, way possible. When you want to take a bite out of something, oh my God, you know that shit's good. You take a bite out of that candle? I do. Mm. Uh, our birthday cake, uh, all the candles. I think the morning they're, they're one? They're delicious. Take a, <laughs> <laughs> I'll pass on that one. I'll pass. Hey, and here's some nine club stuff. Listen, these are larges, we but we'll get you some smalls. smalls. We'll get you some smalls. No worries. Cool, thanks. Nine club. This is our motto that we have going on here. Skaters Dub's kind of... Skaters. skaters supporting skaters. Dub's kind of coined that, you know? And then... Because uh, that's what we do. You know, we love to support... You know, anything. I love to see success. I love to see people just out there killing it and doing their thing. So we support skateboarders, you know. 1,000%. 
the, the shirts go hand in skateboards. hand. Absolutely. In hand. <laughs> Supports. That's, that's what you guys are really doing here, right? <laughs> we do. We love it. We love it. You know, we want to celebrate skateboarding. You know, Every and the skateboarders day. involved no in all the companies. Listen, here's a belt company. It's called Grip Six. It's American made. It's made in Utah, by the way. Mm. Uh, we did a collaboration with them. They're great belts. I'm wearing one right now. Here's a uh, Grip. <laughs> you want to look, see? <laughs> I am too. Oh, it's a girl one. Well, he got a special one. Check that out. Here you go. Let me see. Look at that. <laughs> you put it on right oh, you now. Gotta, you <laughs> got a size 30. Oh, you got a size 34, you 34 Kelly. You got to get a 32. I Fuck, didn't. Man, how big you think I am? I did not. Gra I grabbed you get a stuff 32. because I couldn't find it. Look, she's putting on the belt right now. Hell yeah. There you go. It's a oh, beautiful wait. belt. Is there Beautiful. a thing on there? Oh, wait. Can we put this thing on still? Yeah, of course. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You, know, <laughs> you we have can't. to put it on first. We can't. Yeah. She's like, I'm doing this no matter what. I know. She's going to make it work. <laughs> she's going to make it work. There we go. Eh, close enough. <laughs> We're good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but I'll tell you what. It's a comfy belt. It's great. It's got no buckles or anything. It's just got one little buckle in the front. Oh, what? Yeah. We'll show you how to use it after the show. It's, it's great. Yeah, that's fucking. We'll get you one that fits you too. Or yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. All yeah, this yeah. stuff. Kelly just grabs stuff and. You know, I thought I'd just chuck it on for you guys. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. That's a fucking team player right there. But listen, thank you so much for coming by. This yes. has been great. And like I said before, come back again and again and again. Every time you're in town, come back and and come kick it. Stop and chat show. We hang out and watch some skate clips. You know. Sweet. How does that sound? That sounds great. Sounds good? Yeah, hell yeah. Thanks for having me, guys. Of course. Yeah. This hell is amazing. Yeah. Hey, and continued success. Yeah. yeah congratulations. Amazing. Congrats on everything. Yeah. yeah. Thanks, boys. Of course. <laughs> you too. <laughs> <laughs>